I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared the internet's not gonna work. I'm so scared. Hopefully, hello everyone. Hopefully, you can hear me and see me, maybe. You won't hear any game now because I've clicked off of it. Hopefully, you can hear me. Hopefully, you can see me. Hopefully, the internet holds out. Hopefully, the quality's good. I'm living on a whole load of, a whole load of hopefullys tonight. Potato camera. It is a potato camera, to be fair. I've got a weird angle right now. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. How's it going, everyone? Hello, Mysterion. Biggity Bam. Hustle. Faulty Human. Callum. We got Dylan here. Rezzle's here. The Mini Van Ostroms. The Mini Van Ostroms. Double name is just... Hey, you're making me read big words, and I don't appreciate it. Uh, Corey Wilson, how are you doing? Ridge Walker. Mish is here. Limitless. Mr. Raul. Juice it up. Sorry, I've got two monitors now for the first time ever, and it's just crazy. Uh, <laughs> Blatnor, Mark Johnson, Peanut74, Tigger, Chris Harris, Aaron Schneider, the Kaiju, ISO Channel, Baron, One. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Welcome back to live streams. I haven't been able to do one for a couple of weeks, because I've been moving house. Um... And yeah, I've missed it. I've missed it a lot. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of in the new house now. I'm not super settled yet. There's still a lot of boxes. There's still some things kind of all over the place. So I'm not kind of quite ready to show you like a room tour or anything like that. But I'm getting there. I'm getting settled. Um, starting to kind of create some space that I like. I still don't like this camera angle. It's kind of like high. It's kind of high up. It's a bit weird. don't really like that. But we, we move. We move. Thank you very much for the donation, Corey. I really appreciate it. I like this little lemon grab sticker you sent me as well. At least it looks like lemon grab. Right, today we're going to be jumping into Dead Space Remake. I'm super excited. I've got my USG Ishimura t-shirt on. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be jumping in. Probably playing for three to four hours tonight. Huge, huge Dead Space fan. Um, so I'm excited to see how this stacks up against the original. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm very, very hyped. I'm just going to dive in. I'm not going to waste any more time. But thank you so much for 100k drunk stream. It will happen. Thank you all for 100,000 subscribers, by the way. Uh, absolutely blown away. Incredibly blown away. Um, I will do some kind of celebration stream when I'm properly settled and in and things aren't so crazy. But for now, dead space. Let's do some bloody dead space, shall we? Let me know if sound needs to go up, down, all that kind of stuff. Just drop it in the chat. I have control of things now, so I can I can make adjustments. I just had a shower. I smell like coconut. It's amazing. Hello, Jody. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening strange such a little thing that's her nicole yeah first i've heard from her in weeks we're five minutes out you still got that thing on repeat wow you really miss her this rumor is not a job you turn down but six months apart with only vid calls it's rough easy to say the wrong thing I don't blame you. I'd listen to my girlfriend over Hamlet reciting security protocols. Forewarned is forearmed, Miss Daniels. So you keep saying. Oh, I'm so hyped! Nice clean re entry. So hyped! Did you just said it. Imagine six months staring at that chunk of rock. To an independent miner, that's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up for life. Now, Thank you she? so much, Biggity. I will do a drunk stream. I promise. Barry. It will happen. It will happen. Confirming visual contact with USG. When I'm all settled. What a beauty. Biggest planet cracker in her class, you know. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it so dark? We should be able to see her running lights. Yeah. I'll get us into hailing range. Someone's got to be waiting up for us. Just be careful on the approach. I'm not taking any chances with the CEC's pride and joy. No chances, huh? Is that why you were digging into my personnel files before we left? You track your file access? 
I'm a computer analyst. Oh. Comes with the job. It's about blue in there. Standard CEC background checks, Miss Daniels. If you want to work in the big leagues, you have to play ball. <coughs> Sir, we're in ailing range. USG Ishimura. This is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kelly responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. Ishimura, do you copy? Come in. This is the USG Kelly. Yeah, 1440p. Yeah. Communications black. I don't know what these things. No. Come on. Someone pick up the damn phone. Looks really good. His face looks amazing. What the hell is that? Nah, it sounds like their communication array is busted. Maybe a broken encoder. Daniels and I can handle it in 48 hours, max. Hey, that gives you plenty of time to catch up with Nicole. Yeah, I hope so. Jen, Johnson, take us in. Gravity tethers engaged. Automated docking. Let's go. Immediately. Isaac oh, do be looking dreamy. God, I never pull out. What the hell? It's <laughs> my ankle. I'd be broken. Shit. But better than a broken neck. Or worse. Good call on the stabilizer, Isaac. Bet I always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. Jen, what's our damage? Comfort so nice. Booster. Details, man. One of the stabilizers and... Singularity core is a mess. Could be worse, but not by much. Wow. Get some help. Johnston, stay with the Kelly. We'll send a medic. Everyone else, with me. Put that helmet on, Isaac. Come on. Yes. Oh, it's so iconic. Ah, oh, good lord. Okay. Chapter one. New arrivals. Like. The last film, the last thing I watched uh, in my old house before I moved here was Event Horizon. So like, um, forget something? Nah, I'm alright. I'm oh, just kind of chatting to, to stream. It's like hell. Oh. But I've had worse. You go on. I'll get it strapped up. Nice bits of like kind of um, immersive conversation there that just kind of just happened. Um, yeah, the last film I watched in my old house was Event Horizon, um, which I'm a huge fan of. And Event Horizon is very clearly um, massive inspiration for Dead Space. A text log. Yes! Give me all the collectibles. Zach Hammond, background request. Per your request, here's what we could find on the specialists have sent in for a pair of our mission. Isaac Clark. Isaac was born to P P Paul? 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 And Octavia Clark on Earth in the eastern seaboard region of American Republic. Paul Clark was an award-winning ship architect employed by Galactic Union Merchant Marine Corps. His records show extended time off-world away from his family. When Isaac was born, Paul was given a temporary reassignment to an Earth-based GUMMC ship. This is a lot of like, background information we never got before. This is crazy. It's believed that... I'm not going to sit and read all this because that is a lot of reading and I don't really like reading. But it's crazy that they're giving us like way more background information there about Isaac. Yeah, Dead Space is very, very similar to Event Horizon, if you've not played it. Um, lots of similar themes. Oh! Oh, he's so pretty! Sam Neill was so good in Event Horizon. Sam Neill was amazing. I forgot everyone who was in that film. Lots of good talent in that film. Um, Lawrence Fishburne as well. I'm coming! I've got a sprint button. Not yet. Okay, we still got the the map system or like the objective system. At that pace, you must read through books in like five minutes. <laughs> Me? At least we didn't take out the sign. I just speak quickly. 
Isaac, guess we better go. I'm assuming audio's pretty good. Look over the left side, secret trophy. You can't get it yet, though, is it? It's like Peng treasure. You have to come back when it's in zero G. If I remember right, I think the, the, the trophy was called Peng treasure. Dude, I've played Dead Space so many times. So many times. I'll find it, I'll find it. Thank you, my beard's getting a bit out of hand. I do need to trim it. It's getting a little bit wild. Alright, we're going through. Welcome, Isaac Clark, to the USG Ishimura. I feel so good to be back, man. Rig synced. Collect kinesis and stasis modules from acting chief. Good audio. Jacob awesome, thank Temple. You. Location? Error. Employee not found. That's because I'm not an employee. I can't read security. Same for the chief engineer. What is wrong with their comms? Oh, that was me talking. Oh. I did actually um, order the collector's edition from Limited Run, but it hasn't turned up yet. It's shipping after the game launch. Um. Which is a bummer because I wanted to show you guys the helmet. It like comes with a helmet. Where's the security detail? Where's anybody? All gone, mate. There's nothing logged. No duty roster. No power to the elevator. For God's sake. That security console is still working. Isaac, get a damage report. Oh, hello. Right. Playing around. Yeah, look, that's a lot of lore. I will sit and read all this, but I appreciate when streaming. It, it can be boring just watching a screen and uh, listening to me read everything. What's that? Oh, little ladder. Oh, it's blood on the floor. It's so nice as well to get a game on launch day on PC, and it's just running really well. It's it's on Ultra. I am using DLSS, um, the quality preset, and it's like solidly 144 frames per second. Really solid. Which is rare. Not a lot of games have been like that recently. Oh god, that smell. What have you got, Isaac? Shit. I would be an so escape I would be an escape pod already system. as well. I would 100% be in the escape pod. Engines, hull, the trams. You could do that kind of damage to a planet crew. Okay. Got some power. Ventilation's up. Power to the elevator should be. Hazardous anomaly detected. Here they come. Quarantine activated. Another malfunction? No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Oh, wait. Do you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I hear it. Evan? Don't get in here. Daniels, get those elevators running. There's something in here. Up there! Wow! Oh, oh my god. Let me out, 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 let me out. I don't know how to run. Oh, yes. Go, 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 go. No. Oh, it's so the good. Look at all the blood on his rig. How shiny it is. Oh my god. It's so pretty. Okay. Alright. Stomp. What's my stomp button? Uh, right. No stomp button yet. Uh, plasma cutter. Here we go. It's 
Tigger Lover. Absolutely love how this game looks. It looks gorgeous. In a disgusting, bloody kind of way. Okie doke. Alright, aim. Hold and fire. Rotate projectiles. Punch and foot stomp. There we go. Nice. Okay. Usually my first playthrough is plasma cutter only. I sell everything else that I find. I did put a poll up and it's at like 50-50. It's like 51% in favor of me doing plasma cutter only. I'm, I'm happy to... I want to do it plasma cutter only. I probably will. But I'll abide by the rules. I'll abide by the poll. Hold on. Oh no. Hello, you son of a shit. Oh, it feels good. It feels good to be back. Smash them to bits. Oh, she's well dead. Oh, she's even more dead now. There we go. That's better. Just like Callisto Protocol. We smash them all until their heads fall off. Okay, for those of you who haven't like played Dead Space or don't know Dead Space, um, the combat is all about uh, dismembering. So you have to like cut off their arms, legs, heads. <laughs> um, you have to cut off their limbs basically to, to kill them. It's not headshots like a normal kind of like zombie game. Uh, what's that? Security request retrieved. Whoa! Thank Shut you for the gifted subs, Faulty. Smith had to shoot its fucking arms and legs off. For God's sake, send help! Absolute legend. Thank you so much, man. Welcome everyone who's just been gifted a channel membership by Faulty Human. The extremely generous Faulty Human, as always. Nice safety. Oh my god, Isaac. You made it. Of course I did. They're everywhere. Shit, is he, uh... He's gone. Nothing I can do. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw? Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew? How the hell can they be the crew? Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. <laughs> Drunk stream is coming. Someone will be there. I we promise. Can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs, so how do we do this? Okay. There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system, and the data board's burned out. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of a quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. Get the tram running. Okay. Again, just for a bit of extra context. Um, you've come here to basically... I think you've come... Um, it's a routine mission. And you play as Isaac, who's an engineer. But your girlfriend works on the Ishimura. Which is the ship you've come to. So you're excited to see her. So you've kind of got like... Um, not an ulterior motive, but you're here to do a job, but you're also excited to see her, so kind of finding her drives you through the game as well. Tram tunnels that way. Baggage hall is this way. Oh, jeez. It's so dark. I don't remember being this dark. Good lord. Okay, I can't go down there because I can't, like, duck. There's no crouch button. Serve ammunition by dismembering enemy limbs. Don't tell me that now, because that means there's an enemy nearby. You wouldn't just tell me that for fun, would you? Where are you? There you Look, you're clearly alive. I'm going to chop your head off. There you go. I knew it. Idiot. Nice. Okay. Circuit breaker. Oh. Maintenance bay cargo hall storage. 
Oh, I can have one on. Oh, this is new. This is new. Okay, so if I do that, what does that do? Oh. Okay, so that's opened up this door. Okay, yeah, that's that's a whole new thing. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god, they're so noisy. Upgrade nodes. Good to see they're still here. Bronze semiconductor. Yeah, we love that. Yeah, they mixed it up. I mean... I, I don't I don't watch a lot of reviews these days because I don't want things to be spoiled for me, but I read through a few bits and pieces from um, review roundups from like IGN and GameSpot and Kotaku and stuff. Um, and a lot of them were praising how it isn't just like a straight remake. They have incorporate a lot of new elements that really work and they even took stuff from Dead Space 2 which wasn't in the original and kind of implemented it like backwards Isaac don't bother shooting those fuckers in the head I know it doesn't even slow them down I know okay the only way is hacking them apart those wants, arms wants me to go arms. back I've, I've gone the wrong way <laughs> or did they just start moving alright I'm going to go back to the way I'm supposed to be going because I'm definitely going off the beaten track right now We need to clear my mind after this. Get you one of those like little men in black things. Wipe it all away. Dead Space is like one of the only games or series of games where I actually try um, to get all the achievements and stuff as well. Like achievements, trophies, they don't really mean too much to me these days. Um, with the old Dead Space games, like. I played them a ton. Um, I ran through them a bunch, like on all the different difficulties. And... Okay, it's different as well. Um, I did it with just a plasma cutter, and I upgraded all the weapons. Like, it's like the best survival horror game that Capcom never made, because <laughs> um, it is so so similar to the Resi games. Oh. Stasis. Nice. Okay. Uh. There we go. Let me through. Thank you. I need to use that more as well. I never ever use like the stasis and stuff <clears throat> um, when I play this game. I always forget that I've got it. I just use it when it's needed for puzzles rather than like on enemies. Cheeky little save slot there, just in case. Just in case it all goes horribly wrong. Had far too many. Uh... Far too many streams recently where I've not saved and lost loads of progress, which is just completely my fault. So I'm not doing that today. As I say, I found a something inside the vents. I found a man inside the vents. I found a man inside the vents. He told me to bring the others. Okay. Alright. Whatever you say, mate. That's fine. Come on. That's it. Off with your head. Nice. Lovely. He's just a sack of meat now. He looks like one of those typical, like, meat things you see in, like, cold storage in horror games. Okay. Guys, so dark! Come on. That's it. No, no, no one gets to keep their head. No. There we go. 
He's been obliterated. I don't think he even exists anymore. There he is. Okay. Hello, Kuda Brown. Hello, everyone who's popped in since I started. If I haven't said hello to you, apologies. I'm going to be very mesmerized by this game, I'm sure. Don't do it. 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 Okay. Don't do it. <laughs> Something's going to come out any second now. Tram repair room. Oh, med pack. Ah, node as well. Lovely. What's that? Energy. Okay. Message retrieved. Vents into engineering. You got a stasis module handy? We need one in tram maintenance stat. The autoloader's fried. I got a damaged tram car on the tracks, and if the whole system's gridlocked, guess who they're calling? Temple here, sending a stasis module now. What happened to the autoloader? No idea. A lot of shit's been breaking down, and I keep hearing things. Down in the gears where, where no one could be. You know? I know. Audio logs. They should just play. You know? Um, they didn't just play in um, Callisto Protocol. And they kind of, um, if I remember right, anyway, you pick them up and then I, I actually struggled to find out, like, where you could listen to them. I don't think I ever figured that out. Okay. Alright. First puzzle, even though it's not really a puzzle. Prepare systems online. Loading system reinitialized. Go. There's a tram. Auto loader malfunction. Yep. Please contact a repair technician. I am a bloody repair technician, mate. Uh-oh. 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 Oh. 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 Oh my god, my aim. It's not going well. Okay, that's still stasis. Go. No, no, stop. Oh, hello. Piss. Oh, man, my aim. I'm not used to using. Ugh. Oh, my God. I've got to get reused to like the sensitivity of a PS, uh, PS5 controller. Okay, they're both engaged. That's fine. We're good. Do the thing. Replacing damaged tram car. Please stand by. Oh shit! Hold on. I don't have the right chat thing at like sorted. There we go. I can actually see the chat now. Uh, one idiot. Ah! That was a bad idea. There we go. Is that another one? Hello. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, note to self, don't like don't play with anything here. I don't know own enough pants to allow me to play horror games. There's another one! What are you doing? Oh, okay, we're all right. You got it. The tram was jamming the whole system. That's one down. You said a data board was fried too? Inventory says there's a spare board in the maintenance bay. We can't run the trams without it. Maintenance bay. That's where I was trying to go before when I wasn't supposed to go there. Okay, let's go there now for real. Let's go there now for real. Honestly, having like two monitors... Game changer. Woo! Right. Yeah, honestly.
honestly, absolute game changer. Not entirely sure how I've lived without it for so long. Oh, nearly died. Weird thing about Dead Space is the original still looks amazing. But this looks really freaking good. Um, hello. Oh, hello. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? I don't like this little jelly spitting stuff that's going on here. That was, I'm certain, never a thing before. Uh huh, okay. Yeah, interesting. Is the Callisto Protocol thumbnail a meme? Wait, it shouldn't have a Callisto Protocol thumbnail. Uh, what are you saying to me? This shouldn't have a. It shouldn't have a Callisto Protocol thumbnail. What are you saying? What? <laughs> I... YouTube. I'm. It's not. A... It's got Dead Space thumbnail. I can see it right here. It's a picture of Isaac, and it says "Dead Space." Isaac's back. Why would you do this to me? <laughs> that was terrifying. Oh. Okay, that's really weird. I'm seeing a Dead Space thumbnail on my end. Not on my screen. On my screen, it's a Dead Space thumbnail. It's right there. <laughs> it's not. I wish I could send you a picture in chat. Um. Hold on, look, 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 right, look. I'm gonna go to my YouTube studio and I'm gonna go to the the thing and I'm gonna go to this and I'm gonna click this button and I might break the entire stream because it's just the kind of thing I like to do. And then I'm gonna and then there's the thumbnail and I'm gonna change it. Now this might break everything. And I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna save it. <gasps> Come on. Don't die. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um, I might have broke it. Well, if you can still see me, that's fine. Channel content. Oh, it now has no thumbnail. Which is, you know, probably worse than before. Now it has Dead Space again. Oh my god, okay. That is so weird. I hate YouTube. For God's sake. Stupid YouTube. It's, de it's definitely Dead Space on my end. <laughs> oh, Oh my god. Ugh. At least it's Callisto Protocol and not like The Legend of Zelda. You know, at least it's kind of in the same genre. You know, it's it's <laughs> it's a little bit... I saw both. Oh my god. It's like that, um, what colour is this dress thing? What can you see? Dead Space or Callisto Protocol? You tell me. Hopefully when it uh, ends up being a VOD and people watch it back, it's just Dead Space. We will see. YouTube be tripping. <laughs> Pastel the Devil. Channel's at 100k, computer's running the 49, and the beard's looking better than ever. This might be the year of the Benjo. Thank you so much. The beard is honestly... I just had a shower, so it's just probably looking quite fluffy right now. I get that, like, fluffy beard thing after a shower. It goes, like, bigger and bushier. Hello, mate! Ooh, that was nice. God, the music is still perfect. Like loads of just really crazy, like, kind of brass, like trumpets, and it's barely even, like, notes. Yes! Achievement unlocked. Marksman. Hello? Mate, they don't stand a chance. This room looks way bigger than I remember it being. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We got this. We got this. I'm all over it. Node in there. No power. Okay. Mr. Stark, what's the premise here? Um, so you, so basically, you're aboard a spacecraft called the USG Ishimura. The Ishimura is a planet cracker. So, at this point in the future in this game, they've designed these spaceships that can crack planets open for resources. The Ishimura has cracked open this planet and then basically it's kind of gone dark. 
think it's gone dark by the start of the game. I can't remember. Y you were always supposed to go to the Ishimura. You're an engineer. And your girlfriend works there. So you go to the Ishimura. You get there. And the place has gone dark. There's no one here. And there's like some kind of alien threat. Um, it's very similar concept to Event Horizon. It's very clearly inspired by Event Horizon. Um, but yeah, effectively... This ship you're aboard is a planet cracker. It's cracked open a planet and now it's dead in that planet's orbit. Like, it, the ship is just kind of not responsive. The crew's disappeared and there's aliens everywhere. Um, and you're an engineer. And this tool you've got is actually like a, a mining tool, or en a plasma cutter. It's like a, a mining thing, I think. Um, so, yeah, you play, play a bit of an everyman. Um... And yeah, your your missus is aboard this ship. She works here. She's a science officer or like a... Um, I think she's a science. She might be like a doctor. I can't remember. Elevator. Okay. You would think if they had the engineering prowess to do that, they could think of another way. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I love the concept of, like, planet cracking, though. Like, it's, um... Wait. Did that take me to where I need to be? Yeah, I think it did. Like, I always found the story of um, Dead Space 1 and 2 to be, like, just so good. And 3 went a bit off the rails. But I did really enjoy the co-op. What I'm hoping is that this, this remake does well enough to kind of re reignite the series. And hopefully we'll finally get some some closure because the series was left on a cliffhanger at the end of oh my god Dead Space 3 okay we've got some more of these like power rerouting terminal things that one's going to go down to that room okay right so if I do everything I need to do here Right, let's lights, elevators. Okay, so I want to turn off. I need the elevator on, so it has to be the lights. Ah, that's a shitty turn of events, isn't it? Not ideal. Oh my. Okay, now it's dark. Now it's so dark. Yep, we knew that was coming. Behind me? Yeah, I knew it. Is that another one I can hear? No. One's gonna come out of there. No? Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Are we good. Oh, running on a steam deck, I wish. I don't know if it will run on Steam Deck. I haven't tried it yet. I will try it, though. I will try it. Yeah, if anyone's interested in playing Dead Space, like I would just recommend pick up the original. You can pick it up for pennies. Like It's so cheap now. And content-wise and story-wise and kind of structure-wise, it's going to be very, very similar to this. Oh, my God. Where is it coming from? It's behind me. Where is it? Oh my god. Ah! Jesus Christ. I don't like being in the dark. I can't figure out where anything is. Okay, in there, in there, in there. Isaac, we can't stay here much longer. Hearing a lot of movement. Hold on, I got the data board. I'm nice. Back to tram control now. Daniel, get ready to go. Aha! So upgrade bench. Here we go. Okay. So, uh, 
upgrade weapons, upgrade... Okay, I, I know all this. So, suit gives me more... Okay, health, air, um, stasis, and duration for stasis. Plasma cutter is damage capacity. Um, I think I, I think I'm going to go all in. I'm going to close. The, uh, I'm not going to close the poll. I'm going to leave it up. I'm going to go all in on just doing plasma cutter. First playthrough, only plasma cutter. So I'm going to go big on trying to upgrade this thing and getting it uh, as good as I possibly can, as quickly as I possibly can. So I'm going to two of them and one on HP. Yeah. So damage and capacity now are up by one node each on the plasma cutter. There's some, there's some great weapons in this game, but the plasma cutter is by far the best. There's a line cutter, which is like a longer line. There's an assault rifle, there's a grenade launcher. But I always love the challenge of trying to do the whole game with just the plasma cutter. It's cool, you can sell like all the other ammo you find, and that keeps you um, gives you the ability to like buy loads of upgrade nodes. I can hear one. He's there. What are you doing? Whoa, whoa, whoa. We, we, oh, actually, come on. Crawl over here. Are you stuck? Are you stuck? Are you knobhead. My word. You need to keep the torch out if you sprint. Isn't it? Come off it, mate. If you sprint, it's pitch black. You can only have the torch up when you're walking. Such a delightfully British insult. I was saying this to my brother the other day, like, my whole channel is just like, the, the, the backbone of my channel is just weird Britishisms at this point. It's like the only thing setting me apart from, like, so many other, like, VR content creators, or content creators in general. Because I'm just full of, like, odd little Britishisms. Alright, mate, calm down. Arms off. Oh, arms not off. Oh, it is off. Okay. There we go. I think two limbs is usually enough to kill them. Once they've lost two limbs, they're like, done now. Okay. Nice. All right. Add the data board to this thing. Data board reinstalled. System yes. Complete. It's definitely in my blood, Huss. Like it's, it's part of my DNA. It's what I get for growing up watching like the Fast Show and Harry Enfield and uh, the League of Gentlemen and um, just weird British things. Maintenance complete. Calling tram. It's clear. Can I leave now as well with you guys, please? Now arriving at flight deck tram control. They're just, gonna, they're just gonna go. They're not even saying. They're not even saying anything. They just got on board and just left. We're on board. Something cool. on the roof, but it seems operational. Quarantine lockdown is lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Johnson fix up the Kelly. We report to the bridge. Standard emergency protocol. What protocol? Hammond, people are dying here. And I'm not losing anyone else. We stick to procedure. We'll get through this. We'll see. Ooh, she doesn't trust him. Okay, cool. Return to the Kellyan. Can do. As long as there's no monsters in this corridor. Oh. That sounded like a monster in the corridor to me. Maybe it wasn't. Ah, ah, ah. All right, okay. Okay, all right. Okay. 
No monsters in the car. Oh, two little chests there I missed. Hello, hello. Why did the lights just go off? <laughs> in the original, I don't know if it was throughout the entire game, but in certain areas, um, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star would play in the background. Like, quite quietly. Um, and if you, if you add headphones on... I saw you. Um, you, could, you could pick it out um, just, just playing in the background. It was really quite creepy. Cause it, was, it was like a woman singing it. Um, and it just sang kind of like softly enough and just quietly enough that it kind of blended into the background. Very strange. Hello. Can I go in here? No. Me on the music, man. Jesus. It's insane. Wah! Bitch. Oh. Don't do it. Good boy. No. Oh, hello. Hello. No, open it up. Finish them off. We don't leave them half done. <sighs> Doors are surprisingly terrifying in video games. Doors are surprisingly terrifying in video games. I wonder if you could make a horror game without bad lighting. Uh, I think you can. Um... Not necessarily one that's particularly scary, though. Like, Dead Island is the thing I always think of. Because Dead Island takes place in, like, scorching, overbearing Island. sunshine. To the bridge. It's... Um, There's no survivors. And it does Dana still manage to be a bit to scary in places. I don't think they always need to be, like, these flickering, dark messes. It makes sense in the context of this game. Um, but I would like to see more horror games like Dead Island that kind of set the horror in broad daylight. Because it's harder to scare people if it's like super sunny. Hello, I'm back. It's me, Isaac. How's your ankle? Hello. Come in. Uh, in the ship. Oh, he's taking his helmet off again. Okay, hold on. I'm just I'm eating some plain bread right now. Really exciting. What's up? Is that blood? Yeah, covered in it, mate. I need you to listen. The Ishimura's overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac... We need to kill him and fix it now. Got a damage report? Uh, yeah, it, it's there. That's very, uh, damaged. Plain bread. Just plain bread. Go! Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Where'd the pilot lady go? Oh, okay, I think she might be dead. Oh, I hate these things. No. Come off it. Oh, that's too much. Another one. Oh, I hate them. Oh, God. Isaac, what's happening? Justin's gone. Kelly and two. 
singularity core overloaded. No! The Kellyan was our only way home. We're trapped. No! Yeah, we're fucked now. I'm not losing two good people for nothing. What about the command computer? It's a brick. All the primary systems are locked down with the captain's codes. So we find Captain Matthias. Track his rig. Okay, here. Captain Benjamin Matthias. Location medical. Status deceased? That's not good. Is it the captain? God. Isaac, you're closer to medical. You can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body and get his rig. With his codes, we. What was that? Chen? Ah, oh, so cool. I love how all the HUDs and stuff in this game are. I don't. I can't remember the, the name for it. There is a. Um, there's like an, an official terminology for it, but like everything's incorporated into the world. There's no kind of pulling you out into pause screen. So like obviously to check your objective, it's just kind of a laser that shoots on the ground. Um, when you open up your, um, that's obviously a pause menu. But when you open up your inventory, again you can still move the character around. And you've got this inventory screen that you can kind of go through. I'm actually running out of space. Um, you've got your map there. Missions. Yeah, so like everything is within the context of the world. Like that's like a, a projection that's coming from his suit. You know, that's the impression that you get. Nothing breaks you away from the game. You can always move Isaac around regardless of you know, what's happening. I, just, I love that. I, I always love that really smart design choice uh, flight deck let me in captain remember me a, f a famous actor I don't remember his name the, ca the captain certainly was played by um, a famous actor in the original I don't know if he's the same guy in this one he looks slightly different and the voice isn't quite as iconic I could be wrong but I'm not sure it's the same actor anymore Sun. Okay. Ka can cook. Don't know what that means. I don't know who cat is. But I'm glad that they can cook. Uh, flight deck tram station. That's where I'm going, isn't it? That's where I want to be. I think. Yeah. Getting some terrible frames here. Oh, it's like 140 for me. 140 frames for me. Uh, I'm showing zero dropped frames on OBS, so it should be should be alright. Should be good. It's the best thing um, in, for for me about um, having two monitors now is I can see OBS running. I can see like the kilobytes per second, the kilobits per second it's, it's uploading at. I can see the pressure it puts on my CPU, which it says is like 2%. And then it's, yeah, it dropped frames saying zero. It might be your internet, man. Um, I've not had anyone else say anything unless everyone's just really polite. But yeah, no, I think it's, I think it's, I think it's running fine. It looks like it's running fine, according to my info. Store! Stream looks good to me. That's what we like to hear. Bonus content available. That's because I bought the deluxe edition. Ho, ho, ho. Treats. Treats. Yes. Okay. Okay. I like that I can, I can buy the suit. Uh, no, sorry. Okay, that's just... Oh, sorry. Of course I can buy the suit. I was thinking uh, sell the suit. I can't sell the suit. Okay, let's sell some of these semiconductors. Um, sell that one. Stasis pack, plasma cutter, health. Look at these suits in storage. They're so cool. I don't want to use them. I just want to use a normal suit. Normal suit for now. Normal suit. Um, that's what I've got equipped right now, isn't it? The legacy. Okay. Let's upgrade to... Let's upgrade to suit level two. Yeah. While I've got the money. Right, 
running great for me. Thank you. Cheers for letting me know. Baby. Bit more armor on that now. Amazing. So this is usually my technique. So if I do a um, inventory capacity went up as well, that's good. Yeah, so my inventory is much bigger now. So like my technique usually is, if I'm doing plasma cutter only runs, when I start picking up the ammo for the other guns, I'm just selling it and then I'm buying the upgrade nodes and I'm upgrading everything so that like the plasma cutter is an absolute beast um, that's my plan here uh, medical I'm super polite but it's still running well thank you I appreciate that. Uh, okay so okay so the suit can now be upgraded further. Air. I'm not too fussed about the suit. I'm more fussed about this. Reload speed. What capacity? I'm gonna keep going with capacity for now. Oh. Alright. Down to medical. Whee! From what I understand, everything is open world now. Like, well, open world. It's all connected now. So you can just backtrack and explore the whole ship from the start. Or, like, at least when you get to a new area, you can keep coming back to old areas. You're not as walled off as you was previously. Oh, no. Look at oh, no. It's stuck to my foot. Oh, no. No. Get off me. Just trying to stomp his head off. There we go. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Cargo storage. What is this? Level 1 security clearance. I don't, I don't remember that at all. I think that's a new thing. Upgrading your security clearance. Or is it? It's been a little while since I played the original. Maybe a year. Okay. Is that my kinesis? Yes! JJ, I can see BB's face, not used to that. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Flat games, it's a it's a culture shock. My eyes are usually hidden away, and you can just see my chin. Okay, Kinesis. Nice, okay. Um, um, hello. Okay, I can't move that one just yet. Uh... I pull that one back. Hmm. Don't want to. Why can I not solve this stupid, very simple puzzle? Oh, there it goes that way. Okay, and I'm through. Okay. And then I can go this way to do this. Scan rig to unlock workstation. What does that mean? Scan, scan rig to unlock workstation. Okay. Let me scan my bloody rig then. It's the problem is there's no grass to rub the shit off your space boot. <laughs> oh, she's alive. Hello. You okay? You don't look alright. Do you want me to just end it? I can shoot you. Oh, I don't think it will let me. Oh. What's that? Is that for me? Um, oh, there we go. Assault rifle. I'm not going to use it. I'm going to sell it. I'm going to sell the absolute. Can I sell it? Will I find it on a new game plus? I think I can. Um... Oh, I can't remember. I can't remember if. I think I, I think I'm safe with seven. Uh... I came through there. Ooh. Oh. 
Okay. Nice. Yeah, I am going this way. Hundred K is awesome. I started to watch when he was at twenty K and watched his channel sped sp sub sped past other VR content creators. Awesome work. Thank you, man. It, it has taken me by surprise, like some of the creators that I've gone past. Um, Isaac, have you heard from Daniels? We were attacked. She ran the other way. No, nothing. Medical's a slaughterhouse. They barricaded access to the morgue. The morgue? Yeah. But the barricade was put together in a hurry. A hydrazine tank might blow it open. Just need a detonator, like maybe a shock pad. Nicole could be through there if... Isaac. The one who attacked us. I swear to God it was Chen. But... I saw him die. Mm -hmm. If they barricaded the morgue, maybe it was to keep something in. No shit. Yeah, as I kind of watched my sub count rise, I was very shocked at some of the creators that um, I, I passed. Um, I'm not competitive, and I wasn't looking at it in that way, but it's like the people that I've got huge respect for, and I've I watched their growth. Um, you know, I, there's, there's VR creators that I... Um, Level 2, security clearance required. Okay, that is a normal thing. Um, that I've been watching the growth of for, for years, and, you know, uh, kind of moving past them is, is a strange feeling. Um... Because I still look up to them. And I think I'll always look up to them, regardless of size of channel. Because I don't think it's about that. I think it's about work ethic and um, just the output and the dedication. And just the, the style that they have. Everyone has their own unique style. So, um, Research wing. I think I'd go that way anyway. So I'm not going to go off the beaten track. Store. I don't think I have any money, really. Uh, three grand. No. Um, I want to sell, sell the gun. I don't think I can sell the gun. I can sell it. Uh, I'll move to storage. Okay, I can't sell it. Move it to storage. Because we're not we're not going to use it. I'm going to move. I can sell the ammo though. Pulse rounds. We're going to sell them. We're going to sell them. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please pray, dog. Please. I'm actually not sure what engine this is built on. If it's Unreal, then. It will just work with the um, Kraydog injector, but uh, I, I'm actually not sure what what engine this is. I started watching when he was born. Oh my god, you're not wrong. <laughs> you're not wrong. Hello. Jesus Christ. All right, well, we just stomp them now. There you go. Stomp them. Look at his skull. His whole skull's fallen out. Watching you instead of government class. <laughs> Thank you very much for the donation, Hugh. I really appreciate it. What is government class? Government class? Like a school class about the government? Sounds awful. It's not the worst thing ever. Okay, no power to go in there. Thank you, though. Really appreciate the donation, my friend. The saddest thing about moving to this new house, and it's probably the only sad thing about moving to this new house, and it's probably a good thing for me in the long run because I won't die early, um, is it's not as easy to get burgers after a stream. There aren't really many like resources to, to order burgers from. you know, And that, that does break my heart. I'm a little bit out in the sticks now. But it's fine, because I'll live for longer. Because I won't be eating burgers every Friday after stream. Which is, you know, my, 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 my usual way of doing things. Hello? Get that arm off, thank you. Okay, let's get the battery. There, pop that into there. Okay, let's do doors. Now, will that turn this door on? It will! Very nice, okay. 
the skill of making quality burgers is vital for living a happy life. I can't really cook anything right now because the kitchen kind of is a little bit of a mess. I'm not very good at cooking anyway. But I do I should learn how to make myself good burgers. And then I'll be I'll be uh, yeah, then I'll definitely Level die. Early. Security clearance required. Give me it then. Give patient me security clearance. Retrieved. I hear the tests on patient Harris were inconclusive. Okay, Given that looks good. Given the colony, he's lucky to have his faculties at all. Well, a divine experience would leave an impression on anyone's mind. Perhaps. But I saw nothing divine in all that blood, the suicides. But this is a revelation, Terence. We just need more insight to translate it. Do you think this insight can be found in Mr. Harris's psyche? Who's in it? I'm positive. And with Captain Matthias... Oh, God! Hello. Hello. Oh! May. Look, Mercer. Things are complicated enough already. I can't sign off on this. You do what's best, of course. How long can we afford to wait? These all need level 2 security clearance. I don't have that. It's not a thing that I have. Deliver it up. There'll be a kebabby open to all hours. There isn't, Vigor. There literally isn't. If I want a kebab, I need to drive into, like, um, I say I. Molly would need to drive me into, like, a nearby town. There's, there's like, nothing here. There's nothing here. Um, there's a KFC. It's kind of close. But even then, like, delivery options wise, there's probably like 15, 20 things on there. It's dire straits. But to be honest, I'll take that every day of the year to, to live in this house. I absolutely love it here. It's warm, it's comfortable. My old house was, I, I think, I don't know if I've said this on stream before, my old house was single glazed um, windows, so really thin windows, poorly insulated. A rental property it wasn't very well maintained by the the owners so like you know having left we've now seen there's you know damp and, and some mold that we found behind things so for our health it's so much better that we're out of the house just not a nice uh, environment really it did the job but uh yeah no going back no looking back now Ah, you need to come here. Hello? Say infidel. Infidel. Inf ah! Stop screaming. Yeah, infidel. <laughs> Any ghosts found on the new place yet? No ghosts yet. It's, it's a new build house, so... You know, it shouldn't be, you know, hopefully I, me or Molly will be the first people to haunt it, you know, <laughs> uh, if we're here for that long. But yeah, no, no, it's a brand new place, so it shouldn't be any ghosts unless you know, it was built on an Indian burial ground or something, then maybe, maybe something will come to haunt me, but thus far, pretty damn good. Is this the room I'm supposed to be in? No, that is, okay. Demon! Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. Hello, Ryan. Hello, hello. Hello to everyone who's popped in. Again, if I haven't said hello, apologize. I'm very into this right now. But know that I am very grateful that you've chosen to come hang out for a bit on Friday night. Is it Friday? I think it's a Friday. Dead Romans. It will. Uh, it will be dead Romans. It's true. There's always Peng. There's always Peng. Peng treasure. Peng treasure. Love it. Uh, zero G therapy. That sounds fun. Let's do that. Let's go do some zero G therapy. Level two bloody thing. I don't even have level one. There was that level one door I couldn't go through. I'm not doing great on the old security clearance front. 
don't know what Peng is in the world of uh, Dead Space. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's so good. Okay, we've got to move fast. I've got a limited air supply. I haven't been upgrading that. Should be fine for this first one. I don't think it'll be too overbearing. Cute. I love, like, the muted sounds. Oh, so good. Oh, my God, am I still in? Oh, no, I'm still in. Quick. There we go. Amazing. Right. Uh, zero gravity thrusters. Use boot and suit thrusters to navigate in zero gravity. Oh, my God. L1 and R1 to take off and land. See, now this they've taken from Dead Space 2. In Dead Space 1, originally, you could never just fly around. You had to go from point to point in a line. But now, mm -mm -mm, I can fly around. So, that is boost. Reset orientation. Spin the camera. Okay, yep, yeah, cool. Oh, so good. Alright, any goodies flowing around in there? Um, that way. There's one. So cool! all the goodies that are floating around. I can't see any other boxes to smash. Uh, let's sign up there. Credits. Oh, you get really disoriented. Okay, I think we're good. And then, yeah, it's that way. By the way, if anyone wants to play, you can get the game with an EA membership. It's $14 a month, but you get the full game plus extras. That's really good. You could like this game's probably about eleven hours long. I would probably say uh, first first time playthrough. I'd imagine anywhere between kind of ten and maybe twenty if you really went slow. So yeah, if you if you had the time, you could just do the whole game for fourteen bucks and then cancel your subscription. Yeah. Exiting zero gravity. Why the hell not? <laughs> That's a very good tip. Uh, I rate and respect that tip. Tea time. It's bloody tea time. Hello. Thank you. Hydrazine canister. Still holding this position. Is What's that what I needed? There? Did you find Nicole? No, no sign of her yet. But I found some hydrazine that should work on the barricade. I just need to find a shock pad. Okay. Work fast, Isaac. Working as fast as I can, mate. What are you doing? Just hanging out somewhere. Oh, fighting in zero G. Let's go. That was easy. <laughs> Any more? Any more? No? No more? Easy? Is that it? That's fine. I don't mind. Let's land back on there. Isaac better get a raise after this. I don't think he does. I think he actually gets put in a straight jacket and uh, analyzed. Because no one believes him. What the hell? It shut the whole ship. I'll check it out. Why is it still taking, telling me to take off? Oh, because I can go up here. Oh. Okay, that's new. Oh, I can go through there. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is new. Yep. Nice. Oxygen. Cool. Oh, I want to explore everywhere, though. That's fine. I've got the option machine, so... I can, I guess. Okay, I can't go down there. Oh, so good. Okay. Alright, top up on oxygen. That's fine. Oh. Give me that. No, not that. That. Go through there. 
That's all kinds of shit. Um, that's locked. Oh, no. They are literally the worst. Hate those ones. So much. Isn't there a Godzilla type monster in this remake? Oh my god, don't say that. Is there? There was always the big kind of tentacles in the plant bit um, when you get to the kind of life support a bit later on. Oh, this is cool. There's a lot of like zero G stuff here. Go further up. Yeah. Um, yeah, there was always like the kind of big tentacle monster. Um, Scott, took one step out of the captain's nets and Chen, that thing, he almost got me. You okay? I trapped him in a damaged escape pod. He's snarling like, this is fucked up. Hurry, Isaac. Interesting as well. They seem to be making uh, Chen, the other person that I came with, they seem to be making him like a bit of a... A Mr. X type character because Hammond keeps talking about him like he's he's kind of pursuing him. So he might become kind of an enemy that I need to take down at some point. And that was never a Oh no. Never a plot point originally. Hello? What the flip? I could hear him, man. I could hear him snarling around. Squirming his way around behind me. <sighs> Only reason Beardo's house is warmer than his old house is because now he and his wife sleep in a queen mattress. Like, that's you single beds. <laughs> We had a double bed. It's fine. We have the same bed. We, not not a lot of our furniture came with us, but the bed did come with us because the beds are reasonably new. We've got new sofas. They're green, like dark green. Mmm, I love them. Can't wait to be able to go into that room and actually use them, sit on them. That'll be amazing. Uh, okay, we're supposed to go that way, so let's go this way. Oh. Wait, what? That's that's this. I've been there. That's I've, that's the way I've I've yeah been there. Okay. Is it good or is it choppy like Callisto? It's really solid, no issues. It's been a pretty solid frame rate the entire time. It's sitting at about 144 frames per second now, and I, when I see it dip, occasionally it drops to like 132, and it's running on ultra with um. DLSS um, support on quality preset. So much, 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 much better performance than Callisto Protocol. Um, re really nice to see um, a new PC, a new game on PC come out and just be working really well immediately. Alright, uh, let's get a node. Thank you. Melee and use your fist in the room. Uh, well, you can use. Um, you can do that. You could always do that in the original. Like swing outwards like that. I haven't seen any other melee, like different kinds of uh, fighting. It's just that, as far as I'm, I'm aware. Callisto Protocol was really fun. I, I liked it. And I really I liked the combat. It actually, like, gelled with me really well. But playing this now, I'm like, okay, yeah, no, this is. Yeah, this is what I want. This is what I always wanted, you know? Callisto Protocol was a nice distraction. Uh, I think this is quite a heavy room for enemies, if I remember right. Yep. Yeah. Hazardous anomaly detected. Uh, why does it always go dark? Shit. 
good? We good? Obviously not, because the quarantine's still on. I can hear it. Come on, man. Stop. Come on. Hop out. Do your stupid thing. No? Okay, you want me to go downstairs? I'll go I'll go downstairs. I don't I don't care. I'll do it. Alright, uh, okay, alright. into his face. Come here, you. Bang. Start experimenting. Quarantine lifted. Quarantine lifted. Thank you. I appreciate it. Wish I wish they would make a um I wish they'd make a like a VR version of Dead Space. I'd kill for it. They did a really good um like on the rail shooter, like kind of like a House of the Dead style thing. If you ever played that, it was on the Wii, and I think it got a PS3 release as well. Um, Dead Space Extraction, I think it was called. Um, I, I really liked it. Yeah, like an on the rails shooter, pretty cool. That. One more upgrade, and that is that done. And then we can start doing the suit. Use an arm as a weapon. Officially challenge failed. Nah, that's what you're allowed to use bits. You're allowed to use your, your stuff. That's allowed. I'm going by the rules for the achievement. Uh, the achievement was just gun-wise. You could only use the plasma car. So it's fine. <laughs> I don't know if it is still an achievement. I imagine it is still an achievement. Uh, but I haven't checked. The cop? It's me. Oh, is this Nicole's office? Hold on. Nicole Brennan. Yeah, okay. So this is his girlfriend's office. Audio log. That'll be her. Personal log. Dr. Nicole Brennan. With medication and zero-G therapy, patient Harris is showing improvements. If this continues, there might be hope for the others on Aegis 7. However, Dr. Mercer continues to interfere. He claims Harris's delusions are religiously significant. If I have to make a complaint, I will. I'm not losing my patient over unitology bullshit. Not again. Tracking rig signal. Dr. Nicole Brennan. Rig location? Inconclusive. Manual rig tracking is available. That's new. Side mission unlocked. Hold on. Hold up. What we got going on here? Side missions. Side missions. Scientific methods. Investigate emergency room. What's that? Whispering in my ears? Oh, I don't like that. It's creepy. Okay, you've got side missions. Very cool. Very, very cool. I use a plasma cutter at work. It ain't what you think it is. Is it not? Can you not, like, dismember people with it? I'm sure you haven't tried to dismember people with it, but, you know. Okay. Uh, I needed to see if the environment was, like, interactive. I had this feeling that it wasn't going to be. Dr. Kine. Oh, hello. 
Oh, hello. Ben, what in God's name is happening down there? Precisely that. God's work. How can you say that? These deaths at the colony. The paranoia, the hallucinations. You wanted a scientific analysis? Cause and effect? Well, it all began after they raised the marker. Mm -hmm. What are you so worried about? The marker is divine. We know this. Look, it'll be on board tomorrow. You can study it then. Put your mind at ease. At ease? People are dying. How can that be the transformation the teachings promise? We're witnessing a new beginning. Parents, for unitology, for humanity. Of course, our faith is being tested. Everything is about to change. That's what worries me. And Roy, see you later. Cool. Unitology. So it's always, you know, it's always some kind of crazy religion. It's causing all the problems. It's causing all the problems. Okay. What was that? I'll have that. Log, Dr. Charles Mercer. I want all the collectibles. I convinced Jurgens to show me the video oh. feed from the colony. Remarkable. Finally see what I've sought all my life. The oh, there's a room upstairs. This transformation. What was that? The divide death itself. Kain is erring on the side of caution. His faith has been shaken by these necromorphs, as he calls them. How strange. When my own faith has been so richly rewarded. With or without Kain, I must have oh, no power. creatures. Or the next best thing. Patient, for example. Um, when do I think this will be available in VR? I, I don't. I, I, I think the, the 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 only kind of certainty is that you will be able. You, you might be able to play this with Vorpex, um, which will just give you. Hopefully, if it's compatible, will just give you kind of a 3D visual, and you'll be playing it kind of immersed, but not like. Not truly. VR, you know, like it's in there, it's 3D, it's a big immersive screen, um, and you can bring the screen close to yourself so it feels like you're in the game. But in terms of like, um, like a kind of a, a actual VR, you know, it, it might never. You know, it's, it's 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 still it's still quite the niche, and you know, EA's last VR game was was Grid, um, for the Quest. Which you know was quite a a lazy VR port. Like it doesn't feel like a VR game to me. Whether or not you like it as a racing game is fine. Like that's absolutely fine. It's a fine racing game, but it's not a good VR game. Are they fetuses. Nothing like kidneys. Um, so yeah, it doesn't feel like to me anyway that EA are particularly invested or interested in VR right now. Oh yes. <laughs> but if this game is running on Unreal, um, the Prey Dog um, VR Injector mod, that would be the best way to play if you want a VR experience, if this game is Unreal. I don't know that it is. Um, but yeah, if this game's built on the Unreal Engine, wait for the Prey Dog VR Injector, and that will be the best way to play this in VR. Almost certainly. Hello, mate. Give me your tentacles. Easy. Love the lurkers. I love the lurkers. Such a cool design. Although it terrifies me that they are just babies. That is quite horrible. It's never really dawned on me. Like, what's happening here? What are they doing with these people? I'm sure that will probably tell me. Specimen 426 is ready for harvest. I was about to notify Alvarez to prep for medical leave, but when I checked the database, I saw Ensign Sable has been moved ahead of her. 
Is that right? Alvarez has been waiting on a list for three months now. Hmm, interesting. Dead Space is on Frostbite Engine. Of course it's on Frostbite Engine. Okay. So if it's on Frostbite, you might have to just wait for a miracle. Wait for a... Um... Oh, is that another one behind me? Yep, hello. Wait for a modder to potentially give it a go. But no guarantees that they will and no guarantees that it will work if they do. It's such a... Um... Yeah, it's any, anyone's guess. Anyone's guess. The VR modding scene is um, absolutely uh, exploding in terms of popularity and speed. The, the, the mods that people are able to kind of create now are um, stunning and they're happening very fast. And there's so many new players that are joining the uh, modding scene every day. So the possibilities are you know, almost endless, but there, there are going to be restrictions. Some games just won't work. You know, they won't be able to do it, but I'd like to hope. I'd like to believe. Uh, what's going on here? Why are you being electrocuted? Can I stop it? Oh. That's cool. He has like a kind of reactive um, stance as you get close to the electric. And he knows it's going to hurt him. Look. I like that. Small touches. I like that. Okay, there we go. Shock pad. Nice. Daniel isn't answering her rig link. What's your status? I found a shock pad I can use on the barrier. Can you let them grab you? I don't want to be grabbed Watch by the, the creepy baby path. creatures. Not losing anyone else. I haven't played with Vorpex um, in a long time. I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's had lots of updates since I last went back to it. I think, I think my issue with Vorpex was that I only ever found that it worked. It worked really well with older games. Like, really well. Like, you could almost make some of them feel native. Like, things like... Outlast. Like, Outlast worked brilliantly in Condemned Criminal Origins. Oh, one behind me as well. Oh, there you go. Have a close-up. Sugar, 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 sugar. Damn. Ooh, yeah, older games. Older games worked really well with it. Condemned, Criminal Origins, um, Fear, um, the old Aliens vs. Predator game. Older stuff worked really well on Warpex. But then as soon as I started to try and push new games into it, 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 it immediately felt very much like I was trying to play a flat game in VR. Like, it, it didn't... It, 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 it started to get harder to make it feel like it was worth playing that way. It started to be like, okay, I'm just going to play it flat because it's more comfortable. I've got a better field of view. It's performing better. And as I've said a million times, I don't need every game to be a VR game. I love VR and I love flat, so I'm... You know, I feel like a bit of an anomaly in the VR space because everyone <laughs> everyone else is like, VR or nothing. I won't play it if it's not VR. Um, which is very much not me. Okay, I can't buy anything. Remember to aim for the head or the balls. I don't think these creatures have balls. I'm fairly confident they don't. Fairly confident. Helix mod. Helix mod is very good. Helix mod is very good. I used that for Wolfenstein. Two. I love that he found a little canister of something and like a defibrillator and he was able to build a bomb out of that immediately. There we go. The way they're running up to you looks like they've got massive balls. They might do. They might have huge alien balls down there. All kind of warped and twisted and distorted. He's got no balls. None. Remember, when you reach Aha. the board, find Captain Matthias's body. And get oh, come off it. And the computer's all ours. Weapon upgrade. Plasma cutter upgrade. Okay, hold on. I'm going to go and upgrade that. I'm going to go and upgrade that right now. Right this very second. Uh, or do I need to use a bench for that? Can I use this? I don't know where my nearest bench is. 
I'm mm, no, don't, I don't know where the nearest bench is. Uh, I might just find one. Uh, navigate the map. What's that? Tram station. That's where I need to go. Uh, stasis. Mm. There's a bench down there. Is there one this way? I don't know. I'm sure there'll be one that way. I'm sure there'll be one. Pause the game. I thought I'd jump back in and see if I was missing a 100k drunk stream. No, no, that's a different stream. A different stream for a different day. Different stream for when I'm far more settled and I know that I can stream from this house. I've been so freaked out and panicked about whether the internet would be good enough. Fuck this ship. Yeah, I know, right? It seems like the internet's holding out. It's, it's doing its job. Doing, doing its thing. Okay. Level 1 clearance again. That's got to be coming up, right? It's got to be coming up. Oh, I remember this shitty room. Okay. Um. Shower lights. Oh, okay, I'll do that in a minute. I don't want to turn the lights off yet. I'm not ready to turn the lights off. Oh, hello. Nicole! Hello! It's me! Loop and transmit to all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. I have the art book for Dead Space. So it's on a this shelf behind me. Won't tell us what's happening. Big thick thing. I have that. Why won't you open? Why are you? I want to eat mini eggs. Stop stopping me from eating mini eggs. Why are you like this? Who do you think you are? You can't stop me. Is PSVR 2 going to be any good? I bloody hope so. I've ordered it. Nicole Brennan can get it. Oh, she can. Um, yeah, I bloody hope so. I'll be buying that thing in like, less than a month now. I haven't played one yet. I think I'm going to go and play one just before it comes out. Security clearance required. Boy, Ben, share. I can't physically put them through the internet. I've tried before. It doesn't work. Um, my house locked. Everything's locked. So, I need to ensure no power is being used on the circuit breaker. Oh, hello. What? Ah. Oh, it's like a little extra room. Okay. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. Yes, money, money, money. I purpose this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now it's the only place I feel safe. Oh dear. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. A limb? Medically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations. But it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. I need... Wait, where's that report from engineering? Here. The engineer pulled something out of the machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. No. Okay. No. Piss off, both of you. Where have you gone? Get off the ceiling. Damn demon babies. Oh, one well, next to me. Ooh. Get through there, get through there, get through there. Holy mackerel. I don't know what's alive and what's dead. Okay. Where's the babies? There they are. Where's my bloody battery? I dropped it somewhere. 
Oh no! There it is. Thank you. Okay. In there. Okay. And then what? How do I open that door? Does that door ever open? I don't think it was, was it? So the, this thing just says lights or shower or lights. That's it. So lights or that room. Okay. I don't know how to get through that door. Oh. That was a 4090 handle. You got ray tracing running too. Looks beautiful. Have a bloody good time, Beardo. So yeah, everything's maxed out to ultra. I am using DLSS um, just to kind of help it along. Um, but it's set to quality. Um, and yeah, it's running like 144 frames per second, like 99.9% .9 of the time. It's it's beautifully optimized, really nicely optimized, which is, you know, it makes a nice... Oh, that was nice. It makes a nice change to see a PC game come out and just kind of work. Because it's quite rare now, which is sad. I had so many recently that have just come out and been in such a poor state. Well, that's the right way to go, so we're going to go the wrong way first. Take that, you shit. And you. Oh, look at that. I think a leg came off. There's nothing this way. Really? Nothing. Oh, no. Tiny. Look, just 100 pounds on the floor. Not worth it. Not worth it. Anyone feel that Isaac's animations are poorly done? Looks really floaty. It feels... There's, uh, I see what you mean. There is an element of... I just saw it just then and I really looked at it. There's an element of like an overstep where it kind of slides off. I don't think it's worth... It's not so much that I would even think about. I think like all these other core animations I think look really, really good. And they're very true to the original. Um, but there is... It's kind of almost a glide after you finish walking a step. You kind of stop moving and there's kind of an extra little slide on ice almost, it looks like. Doesn't feel floaty to play though. Feels feels chunky, feels heavy. Um, which is what I always look for. I want it to feel like when I'm like hitting an enemy or something, it, like there's some real impact to it. Right in there. Security request retrieved. Okay. He left me. Ah. Thought I was going to upgrade me. Him, scratching in the walls. Scratching like rats. And you all lock me in with them. Bugger off. I'll cut them out. Bugger off. I'll cut them out. Oxygen there. This. Yes. One behind me as well, almost certainly. Yep. Two. Trying to get some consensus regarding audio preference for those who've tried it. 3D audio tech or good old-fashioned amp and surround speakers. Yeah, I, I, these are just um, these aren't even like these aren't like 7.1 or anything like that. They are I actually forget what they are. Mercer, they're Razor Crackers. You were in surgery, so I left this um, work. He'll be discreet. I. I just got the latest report from Aegis Seven. Hold on. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Jesus. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just, just don't normal. have enough. Uh, yeah, medium. Just on medium. I always start yeah. out on medium, and then I'd go For hard sure. and super hard Maybe after. I was wrong. We need answers by any means possible. That patient, Fred Harris... Might be our last hope. Hello. Oh, don't do that. No, don't do that. No, don't do that. Oh, Jesus. That wasn't good. What did you think was going to happen? What was the end goal there? No. Ah! Alright, okay. Well, they're dead now. That's happened. 
Um, yeah, I, I've become so used to using these. I actually bought a um, another set of razors that are bright green, so I can't wear them when I stream. Um, but they have um, 7.1 surround sound compatibility. And when I use that, when I use them, I like I play worse in like competitive games. Like Hunt Showdown, you really need to learn where the sounds are coming from. But I've learned how it sounds coming from these, and I know where people are based on that. So when I put the surround sound ones on... I actually play shitter. It sounds like there's too much going on. It's like... It's kind of echoey. I'm, I, it's... Yeah, it's... I don't know. I've become so used to these. I'm not... I'm not a very... Um, I'm not good... Uh, I'm not like an audiophile. I've never been very good with like... The nitty gritty of audio. It's the one bit about like editing videos that I don't like either. Just like cleaning up the audio, getting the audio levels right. Never... Never been good at it. Never been a fan of doing it. It's important, but yeah. I'm not very good. Shit. No shit, Sherlock. Oh, baby. That was a quick hole breach. How did it close itself up? Did all the... Oh, like shutters came down. Okay. Okay, that's cool. Right, battery. I need a battery there. Where do we get a battery from? Put there. What? What? Oh, there. Not looking hard enough. Can I throw it in? Missed. Throw it from here. Missed. Throw it in from like here. Nah. You gotta put it in gently. There we go. Have you ever dyed your beard? No, that would be weird. Like a, I wouldn't mind doing it like a funky colour. Oh, nice and bright. Look at that. Whoa, we can see. There's lights in here. Um, yeah, I wouldn't mind doing like a funky colour or something. For like, just for shits and giggles, like a purple or something. That would be cool. But no, I've never done it. My beard's like black. It's like darker than my hair ever was, so... It would be hard to dye it. I'd have to bleach it. And if I lost my beard because I like bleached it and it went all brittle or something... I would quit content creation immediately because you wouldn't want to see me with no beard or, or hair. I look like a little rat person. It ain't pretty. Uh, what is that? Is that like a stasis thing that I can pop open? I think it is. Medical log. I'm not reading you. I'm collecting you. I'm not reading you. I have a feeling there's going to be loads of backtracking because there's so many doors that are like security locked. And that's, a, that's a level one one, but I've been seeing twos and I, I think I saw a three. Oh dear. This should give me level one security clearance, right? Ah! Oh, it's so good. Oh, yes. Hell yes. Well done, mate. Freeze him. He's too close for comfort. You still not dead? Mate. You're dead. Oh no, that thing's out there turning everyone back into zombies. Oi. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, stop. 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 Shit. Oh shit, it's doing it again. Oh, stop it. Thank you. <sighs> the fresh ones are a little bit more angry, aren't they? Do you have the captain's Jesus. Risk? Fuck me. Okay. Transmitting codes now. <sighs> I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into another one of those things. Yeah, it did. 
Something we saw it. To Jen. God, maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. <gasps> yes, upgrade my clearance. Yay! Level one. Yes. Finally, now I need to backtrack all over the ship to find all these doors. Clearance confirmed. Yes. Security clearance is now level one. Fantastic. Ah, nice. Fresh ones are a little more juicy. Yeah, they are. They are. What did you say? Seeing a woman cut her own throat right in front of you, Isaac. <laughs> yeah, he didn't say anything, did he? What the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless... Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. Okay. Let's do it. Let's bloody do it, mate. I never got into here. Mm. Yeah, I never got into there. Oh, no, it looks like I did go in there, though. Because I've been in this. I don't think it matters. Mm. Oh, no. Zoom in and out, okay. The map's kind of cool. It tells you where the doors are that are like level 2 and 1 and stuff. It's a level 2 clearance there. Okay. Cool. God, I love mini eggs so much. Just the best. I never used to like them. Addicted to them now. Fresh ones are more angry because they thought it was all over, then realize they're back in the same hell. You're not wrong. That's probably exactly what happens. Yes! Amazing! Gimme! Everything's coming up Millhouse. Amazing. Okay. Anything I can sell. Or anything I can buy, really. Oh, I've got ten grand again, so let's buy another upgrade node. And let's sell that. Fantastic. I was sent to Molly I would buy your original desk. The chance of it getting to me in one piece are slim. I have nowhere to put it. I think the desk is gone now. I think the dead the, the desk is gone. I did say I sold my original Beardo Benjo desk. The desk that I made all my content on for three years. Uh, end of an era. Welcome back, Jody. Uh, did you play the original Dead Space? Yeah, yeah, I played it a bunch of times. I, I bought it on... So the original Dead Space, when it came out, I worked at a game store. And I was working the midnight launch. And the original Dead Space came out on the same day as a bunch of other games that were a bit more high profile. So I think there was um, a WWE game. I think FIFA was releasing that day and I think there was a Saints Row it was either Saints Row Saints Row 1 or 2 and Dead Space came out and everyone else who turned up to the midnight launch bought the other games I think I was one of the only people maybe one or two that bought Dead Space and my manager at the time was like why'd you buy that shit why are you buying that shit but I've been so excited for it I've been like watching it like reading about it in magazines because we had magazines back then um oh yeah I was just I was just so excited for this game and uh, I just yeah I couldn't help myself okay so is there an argument now to say it's worth going back to look for like some of these other rooms that I can now go to so if I if I got in the elevator and went back to cargo hold on this is actually quite overwhelming because the game's bigger now like there's more there's more places to go um all right uh change floor so on floor four currently floor five okay that's where i would come out okay so i could go to the cargo thing right hold on i could go there and then i could go i could go back to that room that one's locked off. 
I think I need to go back later anyway, so I'm not going to go back now. I think, I think I'm going to have to go back later anyway. So I remember going back to the ship. Is this worth the money or do I dust off my 360 copy? Ah, oh, it's... Lifting station lockdown. It's really hard to say, man. It's like... Davy Jones, new to the channel but love the vids. Thank you so much. I appreciate it, my friend. Um, it, it's hard to say. I think Dead Space is... It's a video game that didn't need a remake because the original looks so good still. It looks so good still and it still holds up and it's still a fantastic game and I would still recommend people go and buy the original. But because it was so unceremoniously dropped and we never got the conclusion, it's also a game that really required a remake or some kind of injection of passion and new audience to continue it and to kind of see if there is still a hunger for it. So it's kind of simultaneously not in need of a remake but also kind of desperately in need of a remake or at least some kind of re revitalization. They've done enough to this that I think it justifies existing as a new game. Like, open ship, um, new systems, kind of new puzzles, being able to backtrack, side quests. It, it feels familiar but new. Um, oh, wow, okay. Current position, main objective, side objective, locked station. Okay, so... Oh wow. Okay, so we're gonna go with hangar. Mad. Wait for, waiting for a sale, I think is um I think I think waiting for a sale is probably the smart thing to do because it's not gonna be unless you're like a diehard fan, which I am. I don't think it's gonna be transformative enough for you to justify buying it again, brand new, full price, when it's gonna feel so similar. Um does it feel more of a one to one remake? I don't think it is. I, I think that's I think that's not the right way to describe it because they've added a considerable amount and they've taken features that were only available in Dead Space 2 and they've put them in like full um, control over Isaac as you're in zero G. New sections, new routes, new puzzles. I say open, open ended Ishimura. You can backtrack, you can explore for collectibles. I, I, I don't think it's one to one. I think it feels one to one, but I think if you really break it down, it's very, very, it's very different. There's a lot of new stuff here. Um, Medical? What's that? Why was I not just in medical? Oh, bench. Okay, okay. I see that. It feels it feels more like a um oh yes. It feels more like um a remake than a remaster. Right, higher damage, higher capacity. I need to start upgrading my suit, because otherwise I'm gonna start to struggle. Um, air, stasis energy, health, magic. There we go. VR mod. If if there's ever a VR mod, I will be absolutely ecstatic. I will lose my mind. I'd love to see a VR mod for this. Um, I, I hope that we do get one, but early days. It's day one give people time to actually make one so we'll, we'll see we'll see in time we'll see in time uh, that's a lift yeah I'd love to see a VR mod for this if, if, if it performed well because it looks beautiful if, if, if it could be to the quality of the prey dog VR mods then oh my god I would love that I would love that I always wanted to get the marker tattoo, not necessarily here, um, but yeah, I always wanted the the marker symbol or some kind of Dead Space tattoo. It's one of my favourite games that I don't have a tattoo for, um, but there's still time. There's still time to coat my body in more ink. Okay, am I back where I'm? I've, I've been here, haven't I? I've, I've been in this bit. Yeah, I am. Yeah, flight lounge. Yeah, I've been here. Okay, so I might be... Okay, I might be getting close to the... Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no. I might be getting close to that door that was, like, security level one, maybe. Uh... Oh, no, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. Flight deck... 
or two. Don't know. Don't know. Lost. It's boring. Don't watch. We bandits are a positive group. Who's being non-positive? I didn't see any. I didn't see any. And even if I did, I tend to just ignore it. I think that's the strangest thing about YouTube in general, or like live streaming or Twitch or anything. Isaac, this damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Entering zero gravity. Um. Yeah, you always get people to say like, "This is boring." You'll need your thrusters to reach it. Or like, that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. Oh man, I can explore right over here. Uh, this is boring. I don't like this. Blah blah blah. And like, no one, no one is making you watch. And that's the strangest thing. Like. You are in complete control of what you do with your time. Don't spend it somewhere where you're not having fun. Just leave. Find something better to do and... And just crack on with your life. There's no need to come in and be like, Eh, I don't like it. Okay? Go. You're wasting your time. You only get one life, my friend. Get the hell out of here. Right. Am I going to be able to find... There, there used to be a collectible around here. Somewhere. Um, can I get over the top? Okay, I can, I can. I don't know where it is now. Oh, treats. Goodies and treats. Oh, wait, come on. Fine, man. Give me that. Thank you. Got a vampire chick on my right forearm. I like the sound of vampire chicks. That sounds like my cup of tea for sure. Sorry, I'm just going to wander around here and see if I can find stuff because there's going to be some goodies down here that is probably worth me collecting, to be fair. I had a comment the other day from someone telling me... I get them every now and then and I don't really respond, but I did respond to this one and I don't know why. It always feels like a bad choice immediately after I do it. But uh, I had a comment the other day, someone basically just telling me how I should make my content. Basically, I shouldn't do this, shouldn't do this, you shouldn't do this, you shouldn't do this, you should do this, you should do this, you should do this. And I, I, I don't know why I replied, because I know a lot of the time, that's what people like that want. They just want you to reply. They want to know they got under your skin. And it didn't get under my skin. But I just said to them, I was like, there are literally millions of YouTube channels. Millions. Like, there's so there's so many channels. There's new channels being created every day. If you don't like the way that someone else is doing something, you can definitely go and find the thing that you do like. <laughs> like, it's definitely out there. It definitely exists. So I don't know why people expend the energy to tell people that they should do things differently or that they should not do something or, you know, change to to meet one particular person's um, likes or dislikes. I find it so weird. I would never do that. I've, I've, I've watched so many YouTube videos and YouTube channels over my life. And the ones that I don't like gel with, the ones I don't enjoy, I just leave. I'm just like, ah, it's not my vibe. And I just go somewhere else, you know? Where is the Peng treasure? Maybe it's not here. Maybe it's not here anymore. Maybe they've changed it. Maybe they've removed it from the game. 100k, Benjo. 100k. It, 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 yeah. That happened. And that's my other thing. And I don't want to become arrogant. And I don't want to become un... Like, not humble. Because I think I'll, I'll always be that. And I'll strive to always maintain that. But I think when, when people come in and tell me that I'm doing things wrong... I'd like to be like... I don't think I am... <laughs> you know, at this stage, I have enough evidence on my side to tell me that I'm doing things right. Because I'm happy, and the channel is growing. So, I think the, the, 
the more obvious answer is just my content isn't for you and that's fine it's so fine it will not be for everyone i'm a very acquired taste i appreciate that ah okay batteries take that i don't know what i'm doing i'm just exploring man i'm just like flying about um, uh, there, 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 there. Give me that. Thank you. Cargo rail tracks loading shutter. What did that turn? Okay, hold on. Let me do the loading shutter first. That's a bit more obvious. Okay, that's in there. Oh man, there's so much to explore. This is this is much more than just a remake. This is much more than just a remake. Um, yeah, the more I play, the more that's very very apparent. BB Dead Space is my all-time fave. I honestly, it's one of my absolute faves as well. Absolute faves. Ben chooses to look after the chooses us to look after the chat. I, I do, yeah. I do. I'm just too busy mucking about. <laughs> but you do a great, uh, you do a great job. I find myself only watching AZ from. Oh, I, don't I missed that one. Sorry, but I missed it because Bloomin Faulty Human came in and gifted five subs again. Thank you so much, man. You are very, very generous. You're a, you're a legend. You're a sweetheart. You're a gentleman. This is very good. Faulty the legend. Faulty the absolute legend. I get a bit disoriented. I have to t t tilt my head when I'm in these rooms. Because it's a little bit like... Yeah, disorientating. Is it disorientating? Or disorienting? I always feel like I get that word wrong when I say it. And if I'm recording a video and I say it, often I'll stop. And it'll be something I edit out because I'm like, ah, I don't think that was right. I don't think that was right. Hey, I'm green. Hey, you're green. Welcome to the green team. <laughs> Being green is cool. And you get a little picture next to your name as well. Make you feel even more special. Because you are special. All uh, right, up here. What's that? Track control. What did, what did that do? I'm not actually sure what that's doing. Oh, hello. Okay. Man, I am just wrapped up in... I think this is not what I'm supposed to be doing right now at all. <laughs> But it's all good. It's all good. I'm enjoying my little exploration. That's all that matters. Come on. Come on. Let's do it. Right, right, right. Uh, oh. Oh. No, it's nothing. Got all excited then. Thought I'd found the Peng treasure. I don't think the Peng treasure's here. Which is really upsetting. They wouldn't have taken it out, would they? Don't know. Right, we're going out here. Scary out. What the fuck? Oh my god. In there. This is overwhelmingly big, man. I want to explore everything, but I'm so aware that I can't. Oh, hello. Hello, hello. Come on. Stop, stop, stop running. Stop running. Thank you. Oh, cheeky bastard. Oh, you little, you little shit. Come here. There we go. Oh, don't want that. Oxygen, 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 oxygen. Oxygen. There we go. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Let's 
keep going down, I guess. Yeah, okay. Oh, no. Oh, he's got a little engineer's helmet on as well. He's like a me. He's like a little Isaac. That's cool. I love that. Jesus Christ. Right, let's go through here. Orientate. Must orientate. Orientate. Orient. Same situation. Same situation as disoriented. Just don't know. They remade the entire game. Yeah, yeah. The more I'm playing, the more I can tell that they they have really done that. <laughs> you know, which is quite remarkable. We are not punished for our sins, but by them. Oh, we're punished by our sins. Okay. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying to me. You. Credits, credits, credits. What's the difference between this and the original? So right now, it's kind of um, bigger scale. So some of them rooms are huge, much, much bigger. And you now have the full zero-G movement system. So you can move around in those rooms that allow you to do it. You can't do zero-G anywhere. Um, but that was never in the original. You couldn't just float around like that and explore. Um, the whole ship is now kind of interconnected. You can move back and forth between anywhere in the ship at any point, whereas before it was kind of less open-worldy. Like you'd move forward and that was it. You'd move forward. It was next level. Um, so this allows for backtracking and things. Some of the set pieces, some of the um, areas I've enc encountered so far have just been new. Just new segments, new bits um, that weren't in the original. New puzzles, new systems for like maneuvering um, power to like certain doors. Side quests um, to complete. Uh... This is a lot. New suits. Uh, there's a new ending. an alternate ending. Um, obviously, visually, it's been completely overhauled. It's, there's a, they've done a lot. Orbital position compromised. Correct course immediately. Jam, you didn't really need to fuck off. Have you made Jam fuck off? You're so mean. Why would you do that? Honestly, Bam. Every time you you come here now, you're just a bully. You're bullying people. Usually me. Uh, find autopsy location. I can do that. Store. Engineering log. I remember this bit of the game Chief actually. Engineer Jacob Temple reporting. Still can't believe the chief is gone. It's all fallen apart since the captain died. Everyone down here is on their last nerve. We thought the rioting was the worst of it. I hope you enjoy it, Robert. Um, I'm really enjoying it. If you're a fan of the original, then I think you'll really like it. I think I get a Bobo VR A2 headset for my quest. Uh, what, the, the strap? The Bobo strap? Massive fan, big advocate for the Bobo stuff. Everything they've they've created that I've used has been perfect. I've just been using the Pico Four um, Bobo Comfort um, kit that they released recently. It's just completely transformative. Just makes the the, the Pico so much more comfortable. I'd I'd always say if you've got a quest and you want a, a good head strap, Bobo is the way to go. Um, definitely. Seeing you in the control room. Any news on the engines? Yeah, but it makes no sense. They're out of fuel. <laughs> the refuge is offline. We're tethered to a full trillion ton payload. Without the engines, it's dragging us down to the planet. Can yeah. you handle it alone? Nope. Sure. Oh, Fix the okay. centrifuge, get the fuel running, then do a full restart. But you'll need the stabilizer orbit from there. Standing by. Fast as you can, Isaac. <laughs> Fast as I can. No worries. Right, we're going to do... Uh, okay, we've only got one option. We're going this way first. Just found out GoldenEye 007 is on Game Pass. I was playing it um, earlier on my lunch break, but the Switch version, it was a nostalgic overload. I did I did the first two levels. I did Dam and then like the um, compound one where you come through the toilet and you shoot the uh, dude in the head. Yeah, uh, 
It's amazing. It's good. It's good to see it running like not at like two frames per second because that game is a nightmare. <laughs> yeah, it just runs so poorly. Ah, a new gun that I'm not going to use. Good gun as well. It shoots like saw blades, cuts things in half. Really cool. We won't see that though. Uh, <laughs> sticking to my plasma cutter only. Hello, mate. Are you alive? No. You look like you could be awfully alive. That way. Bathroom. Might buy on PC though. Hope it's a new storyline. This. Security request retrieved. We need help down in engineering. Storyline is effectively the same. Determined to stop after that. Um, yeah, it's a, the storyline's basically the exact same. It's got some different story beats. Um, and some stuff's a little bit more fleshed out. No nodes. Okay. It's a shame. I haven't fired up Goldeneye yet, but I have heard the controls are super janky. Jamie, bring your um, bring a Switch controller tomorrow. We'll have a we'll have a slappers only match. shares genetic markers with human DNA and that growth on the walls. It's all connected to the marker from each seven. How? Dr. Kine studied the marker. Dr. Kine has vanished. Unless he's with the survivors on the mining deck. No rest easy now, David. You're very close to that monster. End log. I saw someone say, why didn't they um, find Kynes mining death? Um, why don't they make Dead Space 4? I think they need to kind of like... I think... That's weird, because like, I'm a huge fan of the series, and I would have, I would have loved Dead Space 4. Like, bring it back, continue it. But it almost feels like it's been, it's been too long, and the series ended on such a bad note with what EA did with Dead Space 3, and kind of just the reception to Dead Space 3 from the public and the people that loved Dead Space. It feels like it needs to be kind of kicked up the arse before trying to do anything meaningful with the franchise again. I hope this is like the kick up the arse that the franchise needs and then it can get back on track and then we can have some new entries in, in, in the franchise, you know. Come on. Yeah. Ah, I still hate using this, like to drag things. So it always feels weird. Where does this go? Where does this go? Is, 
that back to the room? It is. Okay, I can sell that shit I'm holding. Oh, I, d I don't want Callisto Protocol to be a uh, 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 thingy. Human DNA, does she mean orgasms? Do you mean do you mean organisms? Um bam or you, you uh, I, 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 I don't know where you're getting orgasms from. Not many orgasms are happening on this spaceship, I'm afraid. Like this spaceship is pretty devoid of orgasms right now. Um Ooh, I have one of these. Best not waste it. You just wasted it. That was it. It's just happened. This of all like this of all the places in the world and space, I think this this spaceship is is yeah like so no no orgasms, not a single one has happened here. Not in a while anyway. Probably before the horrible alien outbreak, but not after. Nice one, Snow. You've <laughs> you've bloody ruined it. You've cocked it right up. Shocking behaviour. Uh, okay. That was cool. A little shortcut. I like shortcuts. Shortcuts are fun. Just hope they're not starting from the beginning. It's going to be five, ten years to get it right. Yeah, that is my worry. Also, also, right, I was, I was saying this to my brother actually yesterday. You remake Dead Space 1, okay? The reviews have been astounding. You know, we did 10 out of 10s, 9 out of 10s. You know, people have been very positive towards it so far. What do you do next? Because Dead Space 2 is still is newer than Dead Space 1. It looks even better than New Space 1. And Dead Space 2 isn't just an incredible Dead Space game. It's probably one of the best games I've ever played. Like, Dead Space 2 is an amazing action sci-fi horror title. Remaking that is... Rough. Like, I, I, don't, I don't know that I would... Like, they can get away with Dead Space 1. I don't know that they'd be able to get away with Dead Space 2. Sequence activated. That, that feels too, too... Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I didn't do anything. I knew it. I knew it. They're always, always behind me. Always. Two is one of the most expensive games I've made. Two, two is still... Two is absolutely outstanding. Like, the pace, the set pieces... It is one of the greatest games I've, I've played. Certainly one of the very best in this genre. Um, and I think I think if you set out to remake that, it's tough. It's tough, man. Because part of me's like, oh, you've remade one. Now kind of bring them all in line. And then another part of me's like, you've remade one. Gauge public reception. Redo three. Two, Skip two. Required. Don't remake two. Leave two. It still stands on its own. The story will still follow on from this. Retcon three. Remake three. Start from that point. Because three needs a retcon. All those stupid microtransactions and stuff they, uh, they added to it. How's that 3090 doing, Beardo? I, I don't have a 3090. I've got a bloody 4090, mate. <laughs> But it's doing really well. Thank you. It's uh, maxed out on ultra right now, and it's running 144 frames per second. So we're doing all right. Demons? No demons? No demons? Hello? No demons? There's a demon. Easy. Just blow them up. Blow them up. Oh. Easy. If part of me, part of me wanted to stick it on hard for my first playthrough, but I was like, no, I want to enjoy it. And now I'm kind of thinking, like, maybe I should have. Like, it is, it is pretty easy. It's pretty easy. I'm not really struggling yet. Maybe I'll get tested a little bit later on, but I know how to play this game. You know? Progress report filed by Jacob Temple. The engine problems aren't a malfunction. Card. Someone shut off the fuel. Yeah, they're not really like aliens or anything, are they? Damaged the valves to hell and back. We just wasted an hour fixing them. 
Now we need to restart the south refueling station, but some jackass turned off the power and locked up the circuit breaker. No engines? We're gonna hit planet fall soon. What now? There's gotta be someone around here how to spare access car go. We go. We go. Oi. Naked weirdo. Oh my god. Three needs a complete rework to make it work, then the ground lane is fourth and final game. Yeah, three had some good ideas, but like it just it, it was the ultimate example of studio meddling at that point. EA had a hit on their hands with Dead Space. You know, Dead Space far exceeded expectations. The second game was heralded as, you know, you know, one of the best games ever made. They threw a huge budget at it. It is stunning. And then for three, it was just like, you need to put co-op in it. You need to put microtransactions in it. They need to be able to buy resources to buy, build new guns. And I, it forgot what it was meant to be. And the best bit about Dead Space 3 was kind of how it set up the next thing that never happened. Like, the ending was like, oh my god, the next thing, it's, gonna, it's the end now, it's going to be amazing. And we never got it. So, you know, I, I'd be happy if they kind of just take, took some of the ideas from 3. You know, some of the settings, the Frozen Planet setting was really good. Take some of it, but retcon almost everything else. Um, why? What do, you want, what do you want me to do here? No power. I can't. There's nothing to do here. Look, what do you want me to be here for? Oh, got to go to the room. Um, I bought a 48 and it's incredible, but I have one regret. I could buy a 4090. Damn it. Daniels? You made it. Thank God. After the bridge, we thought that... Glad to disappoint. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I'm glad, I'm glad you're alive, them, Daniels. I don't think they know I'm here. Isaac, I've tracked down your rig. You're an engineer, right? Mm -hmm. I'll get myself admin privileges. Maybe I can help security them. Card. Yay, nodes. Best thing about 3 was the revelation that we are not the first to be affected. But yeah, yeah, I love that. Yeah, yeah. It was like, um, yeah, it's kind of like that. Okay, this isn't the first time this has happened, kind of thing. But it makes sense because the the marker, the marker that they dig up in this one was put there. It was, it was put there to stop this thing. So someone put it there. Um, very cool. Very very cool. Uh, life support or oh my god, that's a terrible choice. Just turn the lights off. I can do no bloody lights. I can't do no oxygen. Immediately regret it. Immediately regret my choices. Where are you? That wasn't even an alien. Not an alien. Ah! That is. <sighs> save? Nah, we don't need to save. We don't need to save. We don't need to save. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, I've got a fuel reading. Only a quarter full, but it should be enough. I still need to get the centrifuge working before we start. Someone really screwed this. Ah. Move fast, Isaac. Agent Seven's looking damn close out there. Come on, stop it, baby. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah, the game, the game really do cost that price. It's a uh, full, full price, current gen release. You can get it cheaper um, if you're clever about it and you don't mind using the Origin launcher. If you get it from CD Keys, um, they had the PC version at 35. Or as someone was saying earlier, you can sign up to a month of the EA kind of like all access membership Netflixy type thing, and it's like fourteen dollars, and you could easily complete this game in a month and then just cancel your membership. There's always a way around it. There's ways around these things these days. Like you haven't got to pay full price unless obviously you just you just want to own the thing, you want the physical thing, which is fine. Okay. Turn that back on. Oh no! I did a vacuum. That's fine, actually. That means I can just fly back over to the other side, right? I don't need to use this. Right? 
No. I, okay, no. I need to turn that back. Turn that off. Turn that off. I can't fly around. I'm not Iron Man. Stop. Stop. Put that back on. There we go. Thanks for the tips. Any time. I love giving out money-saving tips. I'm always down to save some money. It's my favourite. Happy spunking. All right. I don't know what that. I don't know what. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You need to own it so you have it when the VR mod is released. Very true. Very true. If and when. Enemy over there? Oh, I don't think so. No, I think we're alright. Is this the right? Am I going the right way? I think I'm going the right way. I think I'm going the right way. Take care, Mish! Enjoy your weekend drinkies. I'm going to have a drink tomorrow. I'm going to have a massive, massive takeaway dinner tomorrow. And I'm going to have a beer. Ah! Or a rum or something. Just a nice drink and a nice relax. And then a bit of golden eye. Mm -hmm. Perfect. What a perfect way to spend the weekend. That door's still locked. We'll figure that out later. Hello? No, 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 no. No, stop. Stop. Stupid demon. Christ. 2103. Cheer cheeseburgers and a beer, bro. Nah, not having cheeseburgers. Having a... We've actually pre-ordered it already because the order was so big. So we're doing a... Um, doing an escape room tomorrow um, as like a kind of a pre-birthday thing for Molly and um, and then afterwards we've got a couple of friends over and we've, we've pre-ordered a, a, a huge um, vegan Chinese takeaway. There's a vegan Chinese takeaway near where I used to live um, that and I'm a meat eater I'm a massive carnivore. I love I love my meaty stuff. I love I eat a lot of meat this vegan Chinese is so good. It's it's better than any meat Chinese I've ever had. It's phenomenally good. Phenomenally good. I I will never need to eat a meaty Chinese again. Ever. Ever. Never, ever, ever. Because it is that good. Um, sell that. Buy another node. Give me all them nodes. I love me some nodes. Eat the bugs. Eat the bugs. I don't want to eat bugs. Take care. Oh, I don't want to get your name wrong. Ramoin? Raymond? Raymond? R-E-A-M-O-I-N. So the, the part of me wants to say the M-O-I-N like Moin. I guess it would be Moin. But then the first bit, like Rhea? Rhea Moin? Not sure. Don't want to get it wrong, but I probably did multiple times so just now. Uh, where are we going? What's this way? Is this where the? Is there like a uh, thingy here somewhere? What is down? Oh no! Is this the way I came in? Yes, yes, yes. There's a thing down here somewhere. A bench. That's what I want. I want a bench. Benchy, Benchy, Benchington. Miss the bench. Let's use the bench now. Ah, okay, pleasant car. There's a monster here. There's a monster here. Run it now. While well, I'm doing upgrades. What in the? F I'm doing upgrades, mate. What I'm not. McDonald's restaurant and two kegs. Wait, what? What? Ten cheeseburgers and one whole brewing factory. Mm. Benjo loves me. I love me. Honestly, I do. I'm a big meat eater. You haven't... You don't understand. Until you've tried the food that this Chinese takeaway makes, you just have no idea. My friends that are coming over to have it tomorrow, they haven't had it. And they, they have no idea. They have no idea. 
What is that? Greatly increases ammunition capacity. Well, I want that. I've got three nodes. So I can go there, there, and there. I think. Look at that. Wicked. Doing well, doing well. Nowhere safe anymore, I know, right? What the flip? I'm not I'm not a fan of that. Just heard his little noise. I was like, what? In the menu, mate. Now's not the time. I activate the centrifuge. Where do I do that? This way. That's dark. Oh, it's a lift. Bro, thought you were a cheeseburger. I am a cheeseburger. Like, if you cut me up and looked inside, it's like 80% cheeseburger at this point. I had a massive cheeseburger last night, actually. Problem when you move when when you, when you move house and like everything's in boxes and your kitchen's not quite set up. It's so easy to just eat like crap for those um, those days when you're getting set up. And that is certainly what's happened to us for the last few days. We've been eating like crap because we just don't. We're unpacking boxes all day. We're cleaning the old house. We're moving stuff around. Um, what is that? I don't know. And then at the end of the day, we just want to eat comfort food and go to bed. Confirmed. Nice. Give, give, give. Give, 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 give. All the goodies. Thank you, thank you. Is that everything? It's a pretty rubbish little room. There's like nothing in there. Okay, we're leaving. Can I pick this thing up? Take it with me. Looks like it's going to be important. Uh, oh, no, no. Oh, there's a bench there. I remember this bit. Decontamination chamber, yeah. And then they start busting in. They start bloody busting in. Decontamination sequence activated. Please stand by. The best thing about the vegan Chinese, it isn't greasy, so it doesn't feel heavy. So you don't feel like dead afterwards. It just it oh. 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 Come on. Oh, that. Bugger. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Taking too long. Oh god. Come on. <sighs> I have perfected the impossible burger. What using the nation sequence complete. Thank you for your patience. When you say Impossible Burger, do you mean like the... It, it, Impossible is one of the vegan brands, isn't it? Or do you mean like some kind of magic concoction that's just like... Shouldn't exist, but it does. Uh, either way, I'm intrigued to know what the Impossible Burger is. Well, I know there's a vegan burger called the Impossible Burger. It's like the patty is called that. Vegan burgers are actually really nice, especially if you barbecue them. And they're great. Really nice. Uh, I'll, I think I'll survive, Bam. I think I'll, I'll get by for a little bit. Don't be too long, because then, then I'll start to really struggle. But I could probably survive 20, maybe 30 minutes max without your witty, witty witticisms. That's not a word. Looks so much better than the PS3 version. Yeah, that's what's really shocked me, Snow, because I um, when they announced this was getting a remake, I went back at that point and um, replayed the original and I was like this doesn't need a remake it looks so good it's gorgeous it's blah blah it does look so much nicer um, yeah but the original doesn't look bad at all by any stretch of the imagination the original still looks stunning 
But this does just... It, it, yeah. Oh, hello. Why do you even try, you stupid little baby things? You're so easy to kill. I definitely recommend sticking it on hard if you like a challenge. Because, yeah, normal is a bit too... Or medium is a bit too easy. It's definitely taking it easy on me. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. Ah. I remember this bit. Maybe this isn't the bit. Okay, cool. Not quite the bit. No, don't save there. Don't save there. I want to save there. Thank you. This in VR would be amazing. Uh, gotta say, performance mode on PS5 textures looking very last gen. Really, really ugly. Oh my word, okay. Entering zero gravity. I haven't actually seen anything. Um... Warning. Centrifuge offline. God, it looks gorgeous. Please attach generator modules manually. I haven't seen anything from the PS5 um, or Xbox Series X versions at all. Am I? Is there? There must be a Digital Foundry video by now. If there is, I'll watch that. I usually watch their videos just to see what the, the kind of performance is like across all the systems. Just interests me. Hello, hello, hello. Where's that? Hello, hello. What the flip? Where? Where? Hear it? Can't see it. What? Where is it? There it is. Hey. Oh yeah, I can pass these manually. Oh, is it a stasis jobby? Ah, no. Okay. Hmm, okay. What are doing wrong there? Activate the centrifuge. I'm trying. Maybe I have to do in order? So. Yeah, that was done. Generator module. I think all the uh, zero G bits would make you feel pretty green in VR. Uh, they'd be pretty tough to stomach. Here, another one. Beard is starting to annoy the hell out of me. Because I had a shower and it's all like fluffy. You get like singular hairs that like curl up. I'll just like tickle my nose and stuff. It's so bloody annoying. Where are you? I have no. I cannot find him in this room. Oh, oh. There he is. Okay. Oh, trees. I don't know if it's this one now. This might be... Is that it? All personnel clear for centrifuge restart. Uh, this one. Your beard tickles your nose. That's funny because the inside of my nose is growing a beard. Mine is as well, don't worry. 
but they're like you get pairs that like go upwards and then they like tickle. Centrifuge activated. Re-establishing balance with tectonic load. Okay. Now what? Ignite manually ignite the engines. Okay. Oh my god, I'm like outside. Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All this left is restarting the engines, right? Ready when you are. Oh, okay, yeah, I don't like this. This bit used to get me. I should be able to, like, dip into a little gap somewhere, please. Oh, my God, no. I'm going to die. I'm not going to make it. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Okay. All right, okay. Um... I didn't feel like I had enough time to do that. And I can't take off in zero G no, I can't take off here. He got absolutely smushed. Um Looks like the centrifuge is back online. Can I slow this? Starting the engines, right? Ready when you are. Can I slow this? Nope. I don't think I can go fast enough for that. No! It's gonna get me again! <laughs> First death, I know, yeah, like, what? Three hours in? Two hours in, first death? It's not too bad. I, I am not running fast enough for that. And I can't use my stasis on it, it would seem. So... Maybe i go the other way? Like the centrifuge is back online. All that's left is restarting the engine. Yeah, right? that looks more promising, doesn't it? Ready when you are. That looks more promising. Oh! My toe slightly touched it, and he died. For God's sake. Snake! Snake! Why is he running so slow? If it was me, I would not be running this slow. And to be fair, he is in zero G. So, like, it probably is quite hard to run fast in zero G. Have you ever tried to run fast in a swimming like pool? Centrifuge is back Impossible. Online. All that's Impossible. Left is restarting the engines, right? It's like running through Ready tar. Okay, pass. Go past. Thank you, right. Yeah, I think I can go this way quite comfortably. I can, like, dip in here. Yeah. And then I'll do the same again. Didn't want that, though. Monster coming. Bloody monster coming. You're going to get mashed up, mate. You're going to get mashed up. Blah. There we go. He's dead. Yeah, this is the right way to go. Oh, I missed the credits. Don't worry about it. It's only a couple of credits. Hello. It's silent. It's weird. Oxygen. Oxygen. I left that one a bit late, but I should be okay. There we go. Uh, here? Yeah. I want to keep going around because there's other little bits to explore, but at the same time, I don't want to die anymore. Three deaths is enough for me. I've hit my limit of deaths. Oh, hello. Oh, you bitch. Come on. It's so eerie when there's no, um... There's, like, no audio. Like, you're in a vacuum. It's creepy. Toenail got crushed. I don't know, my toenail got crushed. And in turn, that ripped off both of my legs. And just the entire bottom half of my body, apparently. Here we go. Here we go. All this skulls inside its hand. Yeah, get out of here, you big tentacle bastard. Okay. Where we go? In there. I've been that way already, didn't I? Yeah. Big boy. Yeah, honest. Just realised it reminds me of Cosmo Dread. <laughs> Yeah, I think this was a huge inspiration for Cosmo Dread. A lot of people were comparing um, the two quite heavily around launch. Um, I was actually more excited for Cosmo Dread because it was... Oh my god. Because it was a new thing. But 
yeah, this is immediately better than Cosmic Dread. Um, and no shade towards Cosmic Dread. I like Cosmic Dread. I had a good time with it, but um, this is this is better. Uh, suit or plasma cutter? I can get that capacity there. Nice. Is that like maxed out now, or is there one or two more upgrades where I can go down the bottom? Must be some more upgrades. Oh, you're saying Cosmodred. You're not even... No. I'm, why am I thinking of Callisto Protocol again? Idiot. My brain is not engaged. Um, yeah, he's, he's very Cosmodred-y, actually. Yeah, I think... I think I think when I made my Cosmodred video, my very first one, I think I did kind of be like uh, Dead Space in VR kind of thing. Like, there's lots of similarities, especially with uh, some of the monster designs. Uh, with their big upturned arms and the thingy majiggies. Very, very similar. Oh, man. This is a long elevator. I think the, the elevators in this game are the loading screens. That was how they hid loading screens originally. Isaac, fuel storage is unlocked. Cool. It'll give you access to the engine chamber. Let's go. Oh, zero G again. Zero gravity. Well, I don't want to go in there. Hey, Hammond. I cracked the secure files. DC was here for more than just a mining claim, huh? What do you mean? This outbreak started on the colony after the miners dug up some artifacts. Don't hurt me, don't hurt me, don't hurt me. But it would explain why Aegis 7 is meant to be off limits, right? Earth Cup's orders. When the miners found the artifact, they reported hallucinations, paranoia, suicides. But the Ishimura brought this marker on board anyway. Like that was a plan. Wait. A marker? Okay, back up. Where's this marker now? In cargo. All packaged up for delivery. <laughs> Uh oh. Uh oh. Whoa! Oh yeah, the marker's like aboard the ship, I think. What was that I could pick up? Was that? I forget like what I vividly remember the end game. I know what happens. But I'm trying to remember where like the marker is because they dug up this marker on this planet, and it's kind of the marker that's responsible for this outbreak. I think the marker is on the ship. They moved it to the ship. I'm intrigued to try vegan Chinese. Oh my god, some man! Oh god. This is, honestly, this vegan Chinese place is it's an absolute, ooh, 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 it's an absolute gem, absolute gem. The beef chow mein is particularly amazing. It's one of my favourites. And the chicken balls. Oh, the chicken balls are perfect. Oh, they're perfect. Oh, they're perfect. Honestly, what the hell was that room? It was like the biggest, ridiculous, loud room ever. Oh, it like recoils at the light, or it did. Jesus, what is this? This bit is going to be tricky without a flamethrower. Where there's a will, there's a way, my friend. Finally back home, doesn't feel like home. Selling a house is exhausting. Uh, I feel for you. We, we didn't sell a house, but like, obviously we, we just moved, and our house that you know we were living in just felt less and less like our home every day, and it it, it was, you know, just getting colder and emptier, and it's tough. Moving moving house is tough. There's a reason why they say it's like one of the most stressful things you can do. Engine 
engineering log. My last log. Some so much flamethrower fuel. Oh no. <laughs> I can't raise anyone on Rickling. Might be in trouble here. I think my team is gone. Might I be in trouble. I this module that someone used to bust the centrifuge. Part reminds Burned me of out. the flood. Who would sabotage the Ishimura at a time like this? The flood. Oh. On reports of the bridge. They should have brought the flood back in some of the more recent Halo games. And getting us the hell Annoying that they ship. didn't. Such a good enemy. But instead we got like, what is it, four, four runners and things? And uh, Halo fell off, man. Okay, that, for all intents and purposes, is upgraded. Suit. Uh, size of what? Stasis zone and then air. Let's do that. Uh, I've got a little stasis pack I can use. Jeez. Oh, use that. Okay. Why not VR version? Because there isn't one, my friend. If there was one, I'd be all over it. I'd be playing it like a crazy person, but uh, yeah, there, there isn't a VR version. Um, and I'm, I'm a big fan of all games, flat, VR, all sorts, so I wouldn't want to try and push this. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, I hate these things. I wouldn't want to try and... Oh, my God, that nearly killed me. I wouldn't want to try and push this into VR just for the sake of playing it in VR. Like I would, I'd play it with a VR mod. But outside of that, I'm not, I'm not too fussed about trying to make it VR. Oh, I hate those things. How am I going to deal with them with just this gun? Oh, oh, ah, oh, oh, she's alive. Get off. Get off. Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get for being alive. Clearance confirmed. Cute. Uh, do you have a tutorial on how to play Cyberpunk in VR? I, I don't, um, Robert, but I do think... I do... I do think Dr. Greg VR has a um, Cyberpunk VR tutorial or a guide for the very best settings um, worth checking out his channel Dr. Greg, so D-R Greg VR, he's done a lot of Cyberpunk stuff, he's, he's a big Cyberpunk fan oh no no don't pop the bellies don't pop the bellies, no don't pop the bellies ah you little bastard don't pop the bellies god's sake Ah, get it. Okay, it can't shoot through that gap. <sighs> What's that? What was that? Faulty bloody aircon units for some reason. Uh, right, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? We're going engine room. Give it that as well. That should let me in there as well, yeah? Nice. Lower deck supply room. Hello, hello, mate. What are you doing in that corner? He's dead now. It's okay. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. There we go. He's done for. I hate to say it, but Apple's VR headset will be a powerhouse. So based on the M2 Mac Mini, tech is, tech is amazing, but it's just whether they're engaging in that tech for, you know, the things that um, appeal to me about VR. You know, Apple, you know, they don't have a, a particularly great history in terms of gaming and gaming applications. So I, I, I. I I, I kind of highly doubt that that is the aim of their headset. Um, and for someone like me, who 
who loves VR gaming. Like, the tech, the tech astounds me, and I do love it. But the reason I'm here playing VR is the games and, and the experiences that I can have. I don't, I think Apple's tech will be stunning, but I don't think it, and this is all just conjecturing, kind of theory. I don't think necessarily that they will be building this headset with kind of gaming in mind. Um, or it certainly won't be the main focus. So for me, that it, it kind of then takes me out of the equation. Planet fall? I don't want to. I don't want to fall. I think. I think it's. I think it will be a powerhouse. Um, Apple will be social. Yeah, I can see it being social, work-based. Probably some really stunning mixed reality stuff. Some prob. Yeah, honestly, like some incredible stuff. I imagine. Um, if it has passed through, I think it'll probably be the best we've seen. You know, and, and I think for using it for like work-based um, applications. I imagine it will be next level. Like, imagine I can imagine like editing with a, an Apple headset and being able to use Final Cut or whatever. I, I can imagine it being brilliant, like genuinely brilliant. Um, but yeah, I'm a VR gamer, and I just, I just don't know what what kind of application it will have for me. And I, I don't think it will be particularly. Um, particularly aimed at someone like me. Okay, that is not the way I'm supposed to be going. That is clearly the, the way I go next. Did you notice there's no HUD in this game? Yeah, it's the same as the original. No HUD. It's beautiful. Um, but they found a way to kind of build all the HUD elements into the game itself. So, obviously, your health is on his back. It's on his rig. Your stasis level is there on the rig as well, on the right. Um, if you need your map, you just press the stick and you kind of get the line. All the information you need is built into the game. So, obviously, the ammo counters on the back of the gun. It's just a really smart way of giving you a HUD without giving you a HUD. Good. Really good. Nice little two for one down there. Engine power failure. Come here, you. Legs. Legs. Oh, no, not the belly, not the belly, not the belly. No. Oh, you bastard. Oh, buggers. Hate them. Worst things. As Beardo said, a thousand, uh, ten thousand times. Ten, hundred thousand times? Video heads is only as good as the games it provides. Yeah, it's... Uh, con, con, for, for me personally, content is king. A VR headset can come out and be the best thing ever. But it's whether it's the best thing ever for you as a consumer. You know, right now, if you want... If you're a VR gamer, the best thing currently is still probably... Well, it, it's, it is kind of up for debate. But it's, it's either the Quest 2, the Pico 4, or hopefully soon the PSVR 2. You know, they're, they're your options. Um, because they have... Engine power you know, built-in ecosystems and infrastructures that support kind of all kinds of games. Ah, flamethrower fuel. Okay. We need to get that. I'm not going to need it, but... Um, yeah, you know, like, currently, like... Ah, it's, it's so tough. Like, the, the, quest, the Quest Pro, for me, it isn't in the conversation. Because, yes, it can play games... But it's, it's so expensive, it prices itself out, and it, it, it's, it's just... Uh, Warning. No. Engine power failure. It's not part of the conversation Replace for me as a consumer, because I want games. Sequence. And I'd never spend £1,400 on basically a Quest 2. Um, but I just wouldn't. I just, I just wouldn't. I think I'm excited to see what Apple do. Ultimately, that's, 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 you know, that's the long and short of it. I'm excited to see what Apple do. I want to play with it, I want to get my hands on it, I want to see what it can do. But I can't see it being something that I would necessarily run out and buy. I just don't think it'll appeal to me as a as a game player. Okay. Engine power I, I know engine Replace failure and all that shit. I'm, well, I want to, but I don't know where it is. That one's empty. So I guess I need to go and find one, yeah? Is that what you're telling me to do? Oh, it's up there. That was easy. Something's going to come out of that vent. Very, very obvious to me that something's going to come out of that vent.
Alright. Okay, it's fine. Ignition sequence initiated. Please stand by. What about now? You gonna come out of the vent now? No, okay, cool. Oh, hello! Jesus! I am right in that corner. Well, you know what? Piss off. Oh! <laughs> Over his head! How did I get that so wrong? You good? Oh, piss! Oh, nice. That was a complete accident. Oh, good lord. Yeah, I heard him. Oh. Oh. This room got a little bit spicy all of a sudden, didn't it? I'm coming. I'm coming. PSVR 2 or Quest 2? Right now, I would say Quest 2 because it has the library, the library of games, you know. The Quest 2 store is, um, you know, um, it's a closed ecosystem. But you have all of the quest store, all of the side quest store, and the ability to use it as a PC VR headset. So, like, the scope for the amount of games you can play on a quest 2 is huge. Ah! Absolutely huge. Isaac, you did it. The Ishimura is moving again. No thanks to ever sabotage the fuck out of these engines. You bought us time to figure it out. Autopilot's taking us into geostationary orbit. Wait, you're flying us through the planet crack debris? That's what the asteroid defense system is for. But the ADS is offline. I've got the system readouts here. Hammond, the Ishimura is in rough shape. A couple of bad strikes could finish her off. Mm. Shit. Daniels, give me all the data you have. I'll try to adjust course. Isaac, take the tram from engineering. Meet me on the bridge. I'll lift the station lockdown. We need to work on this together. Yeah, I don't, I don't think it's about comparing a console to a standalone headset. I think it's about looking at the headset itself in at this point in time. Or, you know, you have to take the, the planned PSVR launch lineup as your grounding for creating kind of an, a, a theory or, or, a, or a comparison. And you look, you look at that and you look at the Quest 2. So right now, at this point in time, if, if I have to think about things this way because I say I used to work in a video game store for years. So I would have people come in and hit me with these kind of hypotheticals but they wouldn't be hypothetical because they'd come in with money in their hand and be like, I, my, my kid wants such and such, what do I buy? And you have to like weigh it up. So for me, if you're coming into VR gaming right now, or let's say on the 22nd of February when PSVR 2 comes out, if you're coming in at that point in time and you just want to buy a VR headset because you want to play VR games and you want to get into it, I think I would say the Quest, purely because it's got that robust, established library of games the entry point is cheaper. If you just look at it as a standalone device, it's a lot cheaper, so you can get in quite, quite a reasonable benchmark price for a very good VR headset. Um, and yeah, it's, it's established. Every, everything, pretty much, bar the few big exclusives like GT7, um, Horizon, Resident Evil Village, uh, you, you can play almost all of the other titles on the Quest 2. Um, so... If, if your first time coming into VR, brand new, right now, I would say the Quest. That might, might be a very different answer in a year's time when the PSVR 2's library has matured. You know, they've, a lot of those games that already exist on the Quest and PC VR start to drop on PSVR 2 and, it, it, and they're being upgraded and the visuals are better and, and the, the controls are really game changing with the haptics and stuff. There's. Things can change in, in that time, but PSVR 2, I think, is a strong launch lineup. You know, 30 games. 
but you can get 80% of them on a quest for a fraction of the price. So if, you, if you're brand new to VR, at this stage, I would say Quest 2. If it was purely VR you were after. Um, oh, God. I've been down there. I've been down there. Um, but I, I'm very, very excited for PSVR 2. I think it's going to be a stunning VR headset. The specs on that thing are, are insane, so I'm excited to, to give it a go. Think about it, 400 pounds, you would struggle to get a decent phone, console, or even a Lego set. Even a Lego set. And you, you, you make that comparison, and I chuckle. But you are not wrong. You are not wrong. Lego is bloody expensive. <laughs> um, yeah, incredibly expensive. And you, you can get a VR headset for that, and a very good one at that. Very good one at that. Okay, so we are going to the bridge. The bridge. Oh, I want to get to chapter five tonight before I finish because that will give me a good basis. I want to get this done in like three streams, I think. Um, that was I'm in chapter four now. If I can get to chapter five, I'm pretty happy. I think the tech is going to be great for PSVR two, and I can't wait to see. It. I can't wait to see what the content looks like. I can't wait to see what the capture looks like. The the, the quality of you know PSVR uh, PS five capture is high anyway pair that with, with VR. The only thing I am worried about um, is stabilization. Um, because we've kind of, we've got it on quest now. You've got kind of like um, arriving at the bridge. capture options for stabilization. So you can make your footage less shaky. You've got it on PC in various forms, whether it's live or whether it's using Oculus Mirror. There's lots of ways <laughs> Isaac, I'm looking at the ADS cannon. Jesus. They're a mess. I'm going to need your help. I am not losing the Ishimura. Okay. Not now. Sorry? The Ishimura Hammond or the marker? That artifact they found? Don't bullshit us. CEC knew all along about the marker, didn't they? Isn't that why you're really here? Corporate wouldn't send the Ishimura for some off the books mining. But alien technology, yeah, that fits. Then how does losing my team fit into this theory? Hey, knock this shit off. We're into the debris field. We get the ADS back together, or it's over. Then meet me at the captain's nest. Daniels? Fine. But I'm going through the ship reports, Hammond. I'm getting some answers. Naughty man. Mm. Naughty man. Resident Evil 4 VR. No, oh, the remake for, for VR. Mm. I'm still worried about what kind of um, content it's going to have. I think it's going to be very minimal. They haven't spoken about it since. They've been very tight-lipped. It's out in March. I would have thought Sony, at least, PSVR 2, would have been screaming from the rooftops about what it is. I think it's going to be something very short, like a mini-game or a section shooting gallery or like a mercenary-style mode or something. Um, could be wrong. I'm happy to be wrong. I'm very happy to be wrong. Level, Level two, clearance. two security clearance required. Someone asked a minute ago. Actually, it was a little while ago. What are you chewing, Ben? I'm eating mini eggs. Uh, someone asked what um, this T-shirt was. They asked it was an anime T-shirt. This is Dead Space T-shirt. That's the logo for the Ishimura. It's here. Hold on. That'll serve me right. Whoa. Jesus. Yes, yeah, this logo. Look. No. That logo there. It's the same. Planet Cracker Starship Ishimura. They did a whole Dead Space range when the original game came out. Um, on one of my favourite kind of clothing brands. And you can't buy any of it anymore. I've got like a hoodie as well, which looks like his rig, and you can zip it all up the face, which is ridiculous. Um, but they're all a bit too small for me now. I just can't. I don't have the heart to get rid of them. This fits. This is fine, but everything else is a bit too small. Okay, don't want. Do I have no plasma rounds? 
Okay, I can, buy, I can buy some. Holy, I've got no plasma rounds. Sell all that. Sell that. Move that to storage. Move that to storage. I need plasma rounds. Uh, let's do... Let's do like 10 grand's worth. That's not a lot. Um, let's buy a node. And then let's buy another 30. Okay. Oh, you have to be careful trying to do just plasma car. It's pretty tough. Can't find any cool video game clothing. Just a lot of anime merch. Um, if you're in the UK, um, insert coin are quite good. They do a lot of ranges for all kinds of games. They just did a new Gears of War range today, but they've done like Resident Evil stuff, Doom stuff. Um, some really cool stuff. I found a brand the other day, and I've forgotten what they're called. But they had an amazing Resident Evil t-shirt. It had like Nemesis and Leon and Claire and Lickers and Dot. It was like the artwork was insane, but I can't remember what they were called. Oh, I love this room. Oh, for God's sake! We good? You okay? We're good. At least containment and life support are holding. So far. Oh man. Gonna go in these? No. Nope. Level nope. three security nope. clearance required. Don't rub it in. Go to the captain's nest in a minute. I'm wondering if they still have the mini game bit in this where you get on the, the gun, like the cannon, when you're like shooting the rocks. It's kind of lame in the original, but. You know, it was it, it mixed the gameplay up a little bit. Um, I think there was an achievement for like not getting hit by any of the rocks or maintaining a certain amount of hull integrity through the shooting gallery section. I always hated trying to do that. A rock would always sneak through and hit me in the face. Okay. This game is woke. Garbage. Long live Visceral Games. Fuck EA. I agree with 33% of that statement. I agree with the long live Visceral Games bit, even though they're dead, so they can't really be alive anymore. But that's the only bit I agree with. There's no, no, no there's literally no way it can be woke garbage. You're just slinging some shit by saying that. Absolute milkshake brain. His face. Woke I'm not seeing garbage. things, right? That's Chen. You can't help him, Ham. Nonsense. Yes. You're right. I should. The hell with it. Blast him out. Send him. There he fucking goes. He's gone. He's in space now. Johnston too. At least she was spared becoming a monster. We're gonna fix this, Hammond. For them. Yeah. Come on. The ADS cannons. Let's do it. Let's do some cannons. Uh, how's the house and how is the remake? The house is warm and comfortable and messy. And the remake is great, man. Um, retains <laughs> anti woke brigade. Yeah. I, I, I'm not entirely sure how, like, what part of this could even possibly be considered woke. It's basically a straight remake of the original. Like <laughs> nothing changed. They've added stuff, which is cool. They found the stream that woke brigade. I hate the woke brigade. They're just ridiculous. Um, yeah, no, it, the game's really good, Jan. Really good. Um, well, the administration systems aren't doing much. Adds enough to feel new whilst also feeling familiar, which is brilliant. Wired the junction boxes, but we get the ADS cannons back. Good. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to do the shooty bit again. About what? I don't know about any illegal mining or the market. I swear, I'm just here for a repair mission. Look, Hammond, I don't know you or Daniels well enough to judge, but CEC had to know about the marker. Well, the company made it, but shit like that's above my pay grade. Look, we can get into it later. You'll need a way down to those junction boxes. You can turn the atrium elevators back on from security. Milkshake brain's my new favorite. I found a CEC executive key card. It's... I'll upgrade your clearance. Because it's not like... You upgraded yours already? Yeah, just in case. Outwardly offensive, like I'm not swearing, but I think it's cutting enough and it gets the point That's across it. enough. I heard something up there. 
No, I bet he did. Something big. Yeah. Watch your back. I will. Like literally telling someone they have a milkshake brain. <laughs> I love it so much. Like there's nothing up there except for like thick milkshake. Oh yeah, security clearance has been upgraded. About bloody time. Thank you very much. Does he have the power to just do that whenever he wants? He may as well just upgrade it to five and just set me free. Let me go wandering around. Don't hold it back and drop it out at arbitrary points in time. <laughs> Woke garbage has got to be the dumbest thing you could label this game. Honestly. Honestly. Okay to disagree, but making the Cole Brennan ugly, along with other female characters, ugly for the male gaze and dialogue that's stuck. Dude, shut the f... Oh my god. Ugly is completely subjective. They made her look more realistic. They made her look like the voice actress. And they aged her up. Because Isaac is older in this. They've made him older. So he looks a bit... A bit older. She looks a bit older. I, I'm actually not going to engage in that rhetoric any longer. It's so dumb. Like... It's a video game character. It's polygons on the screen. She's not there for you to fap. I know a couple of good websites that I can send you if you need that. But women exist for more than just you to get your rocks off. Especially in a video game, man. Come on, have some decency. Have some self-respect. My word. Hello, mate. You're big. You're a big boy. You're a big boy. Alright, you've got weak points. You need weak points anyway, mate. Yeah, you do. Bro, stop moving fast. Oh, you punched me in bloody slow motion. Alright. You. Oh my god. Easy. Easy. And he gives a note. Quarantine. This clown, absolute clown. The clowniest clown I've ever been clowned. Honestly, like, it's everywhere. And it, it it doesn't make me angry. It makes me upset. It makes me upset for the people that are spouting that kind of nonsense. Because I'm just like, what, what happened to you, man? I've seen the stuff about the flipping female Eminem and people don't think she's sexy enough anymore because they took away her high heel boot. Like, who's... Who's jacking it to the female M&M and, &M and why does it matter? Like, did the same with um, Lola Bunny in like the newest uh, Space Jam movie. Like, Lola Bunny's not sexy enough anymore. People were angry because of the casting for Ellie in The Last of Us show, who is literally a child because she isn't attractive enough anymore. Scary stuff, man. I just don't have any time or patience for it. At all. At and I never will. Ever. Not interested. M&Ms are pretty sexy. The issue morals in crisis, you cut us off. I love you too, bub. By Maritime Law Article 5469, I, Dr. Terence Kine, hereby declare. Captain Benjamin Matthias, unfit for duty. Heretic! Hold him! Ben, you're not yourself. Let me help you. Traitors, get your hands off me! This is my ship! Gr the green M&Ms are the sexiest M&Ms, like, I must admit. Oh my god, he's... You... Ben... You saw I was trying to help him. He's dead now. Doctor, you... you put a screwdriver in his eye. just killed the captain. Oh, shit. We have to take you. I can't. But the others from the church get a hold of me. Run! Stop! Uh, okay, what we're doing? Upgrading. I've done that. I need to stop checking that one. Um, a bit more air. A bit more HP. And a bit more of that. Mate, I'm going to be stacked by the end of this game. I'm only going to have one gun. But I'm going to be absolutely beefcake ripped to shit. It's going to be amazing. Where am I going? Oh, elevator. Is this an elevator? No, it's not. But that is cool. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, where are we going? Floor two. 
I, mean, I don't I don't preach it a lot like I don't feel like I need to preach it with the kind of the audience that I have and um, the people that come to the streams and the people that watch my videos and the people that you know are here not necessarily week in week out but the people that are here more often than not I don't feel like I need to explicitly say things but I'm a very I'm a very open-minded guy I'm a very inclusive person and I'm not I don't have any time for I don't have any time for sexism racism uh, homophobia I don't I just don't have time for it like it is uh, it's, it, it, it's born from nothing other than hatred and I'm not and I'm all about positivity I built this I had this created this website to play video games and be happy and create and spread a bit of joy you know have a bit of fun have a bit of a laugh and and that is for everyone I'm a firm believer of love is love. We all have one life. You know, embrace the life that you want to live and let everyone else live the life that they want to live. You don't, <laughs> you don't need to agree with it, but it doesn't affect you and you have no say in what anyone else does with their time on this planet. As long as they're not hurting anybody, then shut the fuck up. Just shut the fuck up. It's so easy as well to shut the fuck up, you know? Um, <laughs> it's one of the easiest things you can do. It's so painfully easy. Isaac, I'm reading electrical hazards on the floor ahead of you. Cool. 60-year-old dead brain doesn't play well with power surges. What was all that crap that came out? New gun. I have a dash of respect. Yeah, this is it. I have a dash of respect. You don't have to agree, but you can. You have to. You have to kind of respect it. Like, it's it's so easy. It's so easy to just let people live their lives. There's no there's no set right or wrong way to navigate through this existence. You know, life's hard. Life's hard as it is. Don't make it harder for people. Oh, it's a spooky. Hello, mate. You're right. Oi. Oi. Um. They were like down to nubbins. That was insane. Not about hatred, it's about insecurity. The whole thing about making yourself feel better because you pretend not to be the worst. For sure, yeah, yeah. That's, that's where it comes from. It comes from insecurity. But it is just hatred, you know. It's just it's just spreading hate. It, it's hurtful. It's hurtful. Get out of here. But yeah, I don't preach it. I don't talk about it because I don't feel like I need to. But yeah, this space will always be... Uh, an open, inclusive, and welcome space for everyone. It, it, it isn't for any particular group of people. Um, it's for everyone. We're all equal. And that is how I'd like it to stay. So I don't have time for people coming in and being like, this is woke nonsense. The ladies in this video game aren't sexy anymore. I used to have a hard-on, but now it's gone. Clearance confirmed. Nice. I need to watch Last of Us, man. I've watched the first episode, and it was so freaking good. And I haven't watched the second one yet. And now I'm kind of thinking, I may as well wait until Monday, and I'll watch episodes two and three back to back. Because apparently, apparently, episode three is, like, critics call it one of the best hours of TV in, in years kind of thing. So I'm very excited. I love the first episode. Very good. Very, very good. I don't know where I'm going, by the way. There's no more respect in the world. That's very true. And you see it. You see it in small places. You see it in places that like should be. It should, it should be really easy to show respect. Like, I go to the cinema a lot. Like, I'm, I'm sure, like, most of you know that. I go to the cinema quite a lot because I'm, I'm, I'm a big, like, cinephile. I, I love movies. And over the past, like, three years, 
it has gotten so much worse to go to the cinema because the, the younger people who are kind of growing up and now coming to the cinema, they have they have no respect. They they will talk for the whole thing. They don't they don't see the need to be quiet. They don't they don't they don't respect anyone else in there enough to be quiet. And it's like every single film. And it's one of those things like I thought it was just like a, I was like, oh I'm just turning into a grumpy old man. But I've spoken to friends and they all say the same, like it's just harder and harder to go to the cinema and have a good time because there's always people in there just talking full volume, like throughout the whole film. And that's fine to do if you want to. If you talk through films, if that's what if that's what you do. That's fine. But not in the cinema when everyone else is paid to be there. I didn't pay to listen to you. I paid to watch the film. God, I do sound like an old man. Ah! Stop it. If he keeps on with the same rhetoric, you can I think you can just ban him. I think that is an option. I don't, I don't that like that is a, a line that I draw. I'm happy to give people chances to like if if they keep on at it, you just have to ban them, cut your losses. I do always I believe in like a bit of a, a three strikes and you're out kind of thing. I'm not, I'm not just like, ah you're gone. Unless someone came in and immediately started spouting off really hateful stuff, they'd be gone immediately, but uh <laughs> Just got an update. Power diverted from my. Oh no 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 no! We still need more power. Come here. Couple more systems to do it. No no go! Stupid pterodactyls! I hate those things. You get them quick enough though, and you're and you're all right. Oh hello 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 hello. More? I don't even know. <sighs> I'm trying to ban someone. Oh, okay, maybe it's maybe it's only me that has that kind of power. Maybe I have the power to do that. <laughs> I don't know. I've really not had to ban that many people on this channel, which is kind of cool. Uh, I've banned so many words now. It's, it's actually, you know, alarming that you guys can even speak in the chat. The amount of, like, strings of words I had to ban because of those weird bots that are like, text me on Telegram, you've won a prize. Absolute nightmare. I banned, like, whole strings of words like, congratulations, you have. Congratulations, you are. Congratulations, winner. Uh, so many strings of words I've, I've banned. Some woke stuff is shoehorned into things like checking boxes instead of telling a good story. It, that's, a, that's, a, that's a tough, that's a tough line in the sand to draw VRFI because she, she, it becomes difficult. To, I think, anyway, I, I truly believe it was very difficult for you to stand there and tell me what was shoehorned in and what wasn't. And that, that's where it's dangerous. That's very dangerous, like mindset, because I'm a firm believer of like you know when it comes to TV shows, films, and things. If we, if we just use the example of like someone who people might say is cast for woke reasons. I'm a, I'm a firm believer of if they got that role, they got that role because they were the right person for the role, let's say. They auditioned well, made sense. Um, the production team, if you start going down the route of saying, ah, you've been shoehorned in. How do you know that? How can, what's your justification of them being shoehorned in? It's, it's a bold claim to make. What's that? A recording? Huh. Especially when you have no. Uh, so it is the same. Inside. That marker. That's the symbol of the Church of Unitology. I didn't take you for a believer, Isaac. My mother was. But if we found I did. I never banned you from the channel, verified. I never did. I never what did. Does that mean? Ever. That Unitology's onto something. Unitology's never did that. Full of shit. Forget it. I think I blocked you on Twitter for a bit. <laughs> well, that was about it. Uh, aha! There we go. 
Look at that. Cool. I'm, I'm, on, I'm on such autopilot with this game now because it, I've fallen into a bit here where it now is very similar to the original. There's still a couple of little surprises. But it's very similar. Um, uh, and that's just kind of allowing me to just... I know where I'm going. I know what I'm doing. It's quite nice. It's comfy. Source material versus the adaptation. Mm. Mm. Even then, even then, very difficult. It's very difficult because you aren't, you know, you're not in the writer's room. You don't know what they're trying to achieve. You don't know what the goal is. You don't know, I mean, unless you're the creator of the thing, you're never going to know for sure. And then that's, that's where it's dangerous. That's where it's a slippery slope. Because it becomes very easy to blame wokeness. But no one knows. You don't know. You don't know why those choices were made. Hello there. Oh, you're dead. That's good. No? Still alive? Alright, cool. I think... Get him. Let's shoot him. I think these things will kill me in one if I go in them. Come on, show me your tentacles. Show me those tentacles. I bloody love tentacles. They're my favourite. Hello? Hello? from ah no Isaac get out Jesus Christ do I have any health drinks health milkshakes yeah I want that god I don't have much though do I I'm running low on that stuff take it Huss sweetest of dreams time is it? Mm. I'll get this chapter done. I'll get this chapter done. It's such a, like, games like this, I could stream for, like, 24 hours. Like, I just, I wouldn't stop. Is that a big one? Fuck up. just not a problem anymore like I remember playing this game for the first time being terrified of them bit of stasis chop their legs off Bob's your uncle easy peasy lemon squeezy nice okay 2209 How do I do that? Okay. One of them. We'll turn it off. Bloody big rock sitting there. That's come right through the. Uh, where okay. has that come from? Power reroute from the electrical system. Just watch the outlets. The grid's unstable. That's, That's illogical, isn't it? One look. more system and we'll have power for the ADS. It's broken through Thank here, you. but where else would it have come from? So unless there was just a rock sitting in that room above and then the floor gave through, that doesn't make any sense. Because there would be an impact hole on the outer hull rather than just inside. I know I'm picking holes there, but these are the things that matter to me. I need to know where the big giant rocks have come from. If you're putting a big rock in your game, I need to know where it's come from. Right, back to the cannon now, I think. Take care, Bazools! It's ridiculous that you're still talking. Yeah. Oh, is that a drink for me? Thank you. I'm very, very thirsty. Mm. Heating's not on, is it? <laughs> I'm like, hot in here. 
I only realized it like a couple of hours ago. I was like, I'm, this is a very hot room. This is much hotter than the room I'm used to being in when yeah. I do this. And then the lights don't help. <laughs> Turn it off. Oh, okay, that's fine. As long as it's not too loud for you. I only closed it because I didn't want to keep you, uh, I didn't want to like, annoy you. And if you went to bed, I didn't want you to hear me waffling. Oh, okay. Thank you for my drink. I am sufficiently hydrated now. Isaac, I cracked the Ishimura's Matsai report. Oh, I can, yeah, I can ban people. I'm, I can ban people. I'm like a banning machine. Uh, who is this person? This person here. Um, hide user on this channel. Done. There you go. Easy. Easy peasy. Habitat changer. It just means they can't comment on anything I ever do ever again. I think that's death spreading. I never know if it tells them that, or like if they're there still like typing, leaving comments. Like like an angry chihuahua human. And then But then they don't go anywhere and they think they're getting through, but they don't know. If they're still there, they know right now. He's doing it in like two seconds. Yeah, Faulty's like on it. He's like lightning speed removing comments. It's amazing. Hello. Hello. What are you, hello, what are you, what are you sat about? Piss off you. And you. Oh, there's a breeze coming through now. Now that door's open. There's a proper breeze coming through the room. It is so hot in here. It is sweaty. Sweaty, sweaty, Betty. Don't like art to be censored. I don't... I don't this, this is... This is... Again, and again, I don't... I'm not trying to project that I think you're being hateful at all. I think it's just... It's just a... It's an interesting and difficult conversation to have because I don't think art is necessarily... Ooh! Temperature. Uh... It's 22 degrees. Oh. Ah, oh, it's because you've been cooking. That's why it's so hot. Makes sense. 22 degrees. It's like summer. I love it. Uh, yeah, so it's not... I'm not... Yeah, it's, it's just an interesting conversation to have because you say art's being being uh, censored. I, I would I would argue that it's not. I'd argue that new art is being created. I think if, if you're going back and changing old art, I don't... I'm not a fan of that. I think old art is a, a, a product of its time. Um, and some old art, books, films, music, etc., is hard to digest. It's hard to listen to. It's hard to watch because it's a project of its time. Product of its time, and we've we've come a long way since then. That where am I going? Um, you know, we've changed. We've learned as a culture, and I think that in that regard, oh, I'm going this way. In that regard, yeah, certain old art is very difficult to digest now because you look at it and you're like, oh my god, how do we ever think that way? How do we ever act that way? Yeah, that's horrific. Um, so in that regard, yeah, I think like going back and censoring old art or books, I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. But new art that does things based on original source material in a different way, you're just creating new art. You're creating new experiences. It might not be faithful to the original source material, but the original source material still exists. No one's taking it away. No one's getting rid of it. Oh my god. Hello. Alright. And the, I, I use the same um, logic. Hold on. I use the same... <laughs> shut up talking. I use the same logic um, when people get angry about remakes and remasters for games, and I'm like, the original's still there. The original's not going anywhere. It's Master security. Level. Master security override required. All right. People get angry about remakes and remasters, and they're like, ah, it's not true to the original one. It's like, that's fine. The original's still there. The original still exists. You can still go and play that. It's that no one's taking it away from you. They've just created something new. It's new art based on the foundation of that original piece. Um, I saw a lot of that when Resident Evil VR came out. Um, and you know, some changes were made because some things. Oh my god! Come on. Cool. 
um, yeah, Resident Evil VR came out, uh, Resident Evil 4 VR, and people were saying, like, oh, it's, it's woke, it's, they've removed these things, it's, it's rubbish, blah, blah, blah. Um, and and it, it baffled me, because I was like, Resi 4 still exists. Like, <laughs> you can still play that game if you want those remarks that were said, that were a prob that we have now kind of gone back and thought, hey, maybe that's not okay to say. Maybe that's not all right. You know, if you still want them, go play Resi 4. It's still there. <laughs> They've not been removed from it, you know? No one's taking away these things from you. The ADS cannons are back online. We... Wait, auto-targeting offline. Calibration data not found. Oh, here we go. No auto-targeting. The cannons are useless. What about manual targeting? You want to go out there with all that shit raining down and target the ADS cannons manually? Did you know alligators eat the whole turtle? The shell, It'll the juicy meat, the, the head, everything. Idea. That's disgusting. I'll open exterior access. And it terrifies me at how strong an alligator's um, bite must be. Like, I knew it would be strong. Like, I'm not, I'm not dumb, but that is scary. Look, I can't carry anything. I need to find a bloody storage box thing. Uh, I'm running out of storage space. What can I get rid of? I don't really want to get rid of anything. I want to sell it. I can use one more heal. I can use two more heals, actually. Take that. Take that. Oh, a new rig. A new outfit to wear. That's fun. Faulty is your turtle from Mario. Wait, you have a turtle tattoo? That's fucking cool. That's very cool. I've got the... Uh, Inky from Pac-Man. Um, and my friend Jamie's got a uh, one-up mushroom from Mario. We got them at the same time. What's the plan? I'll seek a few of the oh, non-matching, matching tools. tattoos. I target an asteroid, and cannons taken out, and I recalibrate the system. We're out of options. Do it. Alright, we've got to do the stupid gun bit where I have to shoot asteroids. I hate this bloody bit, but it's fine. We're going to do it. We're going to do it first time, and I'm going to do it perfectly. No asteroids are going to hit this bloody ship. Not a single one. I promise you that now. I shouldn't say promise. Oh, I've got to do this bit first. Oh, fuck. I forgot about this bit. Ah. Synced a tool with ADS cannons. Wait, what? What are we doing? What? I don't know, this is different. This is new, this is different, this is scary. Sinking targeting system. Oh, what the this is different, completely different. Okay. Oh, this is yeah, this is completely different. This is actually better. Okay. That one. That one. Calibration cool. complete. I like this. I like this. This is much better. Okay. Warning. Hull integrity compromised. I know, I know. I'm going to get another one. I'm going to get another one. Don't worry. Don't worry. Sinking targeting system. Ooh, nearly. Hull integrity. I'm not. I'm, okay, I'm not gonna, if there's a, an achievement for it, I'm definitely not going to get it. It's already down to probably save up percent Calibration Done. complete. Cannon auto targeting online. That almost killed me. One more. One more, one more, one more, one more. Oh, you cheeky bastard. Sinking targeting system. Oh, pressing the wrong button. I'm trying to shoot with my bloody plasma car. I'm an idiot. Is there an alien can shoot me? Yeah, there is, down there. You little dick. Go away, go away, go away. Go away. I'm doing something. I'm doing something really important, mate. Oh, piss off. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. Okay. We've got bloody these to get rid of. Data migration complete. Done, right? ADS recalibrated. Auto targeting systems enabled. Sick. They're Done. Back. The ADS cannons are online ship wide. Thank God. Engage What's that there? Pilot. Get yourself inside, Isaac. White's rig. I think rig. I figured out our next move. What is that? What's White's rig? I don't know what that item is. That's new. It's a new thing. I'm having it. I'm taking it. I'm going home with it. Bloody taking it home. 
This is dope. Yeah, this is much better than it was in the original. The original, you sat in like a chair and you just shot cannons out of... Well, you just shot some cannons. That, that's cooler, like, floating down here. Plus, adding all this kind of zero-G stuff into Dead Space 1 is just a stroke of genius. Just freshens up the gameplay. Like, just, it, it, it feels new when you're in these sections. Everything else feels pretty familiar, but these bits feel great. Land. There we go. Exiting zero gravity. Okay, are we done with that bit? Yeah, nice. Save. Mr. Smiley, I finally made a live stream, yay. Thanks for coming, man. I really appreciate it. <laughs> I do it every Friday, but it's usually done by now. But because it's Dead Space, I can't stop playing. Evening Harold? This is senior medical officer Nicole Almost Brennan. got a vanilla ice tattoo when I was 15. You should have done it, man. Medical this is a sanctuary. All survivors, please join us. Nicole. I'm going back to medical. Makes sense. I'll head to the crew deck and look for survivors from the bridge. I'll be in touch. The crew deck. Wonder if you know something we don't. Hmm. I wonder. He is a naughty boy. He didn't tell us the real reason why we're here. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, I hate these. Things start getting a bit fucky now. Creatures are like just heads or hands with tentacles pouring out of them. It's not, it's not great. Do I get any items from these? Uh, energy for the gun that I don't need. I need a bloody thingy, thingy thing, T tool, the uh, bench thing. Jeez. Take care, Jan. Enjoy. He commented. Did he get through? How? I've hidden him from the channel. He should. He should. He should. He should not be able to get through. Hit him on the channel. Interesting. I think to like ban someone is actually quite complicated. You need to like go to their YouTube profile to their like channel and then you ban it there there's an option there oh nice take care Paul enjoy right children bloody children wait is there a creature oh there is oh he is I am certainly not a child, Paul. I was born in 1987, I'll have you know. Ripe old age of 35. What is happening? Oh my god. Oh, for God's sake. Oh no, they came out. No, no, no. No. That's such a waste of ammo. Holy shit. My god. Glad to see it run smoother than Callisto Protocol on release day. Yeah, a hell of a lot smoother. It's night and day. Callisto Protocol was an absolute mess. Okay. Um, suit level 3, intermediate engineer rig. Cool. Super symmetry tether contact beam. Yeah. Is that it? What was the other thing I picked up? I really don't know what that was. Uh, sell that. Set all this stuff. Don't know what that was. Sell that. Right. Sell all these. What was that I put in storage? What is that? Pulse rifle upgrade. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, inventory. It's starting to get a bit tight now. Um, right. I will buy... The suit upgrade. 1982, 1981, baby! You old motherfucker. By Ben, great stream. I was 1963. You beat me. You win. I can't catch you now, I'm afraid. I'm a product of the 70s. Technically, I'm a product of the 80s. I like to say I'm an 80s kid, but I barely scraped in at the end of the 80s. 
But we're still there to enjoy like Transformers and stuff. Although I was probably watching reruns in the 90s if we're all honest with each other. How many can I buy? 54. You don't look 86. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I don't think she is. Something tells me she's definitely not 86. 86. I should one year older than me. So depending on birthdays, you'll be 36. Clearance confirmed. Or maybe 35, but going on 36. Uh, no, she'll be 36 already. 37 this year. I'm 36 this year. Yeah. Math class with Beardo. I can just about figure out numbers. Did I get anything good just then? Or was it all just tat? Tat. Take it back to the machine. Trapdoor, Banana Man, and the Banana Splits. I remember all of those. Beardo, you've gone from boyish excitement to highly concentrated gamer. I know, right? It's because I'm playing something... Yeah. Yeah. It's the difference of when I play something like this that I've been waiting for for so long. Um, Dead Space is, is, yeah, really is one of my favourites. So I'm like, I'm in. But having a second monitor means I can still see the chat, which is great. Because before I was reading chat off this tiny little monitor and it displayed in like, um, it was something like 420p. <laughs> uh, it, was, it, was, it was terrible. But funny. Alright, return to medical deck. Medical. medical. Round the twist. Have you ever, ever felt like this? When strange things happen, are you going round the twist? Have you ever, ever felt like this? Love that show. Fun house. Yep. Yeah. Oh. I think that was a, I think that was a theme song. Wait, you said the chemical lab? I can, I can, broom, I can hear you. Broom, broom. Was it bro was it Brum? Was there a, was a show called Brum, wasn't there? It was a little car. You just drive around, get into like all kinds of car fun stuff. No, don't save there. It's a real wacky place where anything can go. Something like that. I've been down there. Have I been down there before? Probably have. Yeah, I've been down here before. I've been down there before. Good place to be. Pee Wee Herman. I don't really know Pee Wee Herman. It might be an, an American thing, maybe. It's not really a UK thing, I don't think. I didn't really have... Not to me, anyway, no kind of, like, cultural impact. Chuckle Brothers. Do love Chuckle Brothers. Jamie and his magic torch. That's a good one. Uh... Hello. The door to medical just locked behind me. Hello. Hello. Another survivor. <gasps> At last. You'll be safe here. I'm a doctor. I don't think I will be safe here. You? You're not here for sanctuary then. Blues Clues? Well, Do you see the case. Scottish voiceover Shall trapped door on YouTube? Ah, I don't want to. That sounds terrifying. Doors, and I'll find her myself. Are you that selfish? You might let something in. Or out. Shit. So, you've decided to be difficult. <gasps> Take a seat. I'm not deciding to be difficult. I'm trapped here, mate. I don't really have much choice. Oh, this bit's cool. You get the big unkillable monster. Love this thing. Hate it, but love it. Oh, hello. I need to try and be really accurate with my shots because... Um, I'm kind of running dangerously low on plasma ammo. Things should balance out soon because I should start to sell. I should start to find more stuff to sell, which I can just keep turning into plasma ammo. So I don't need to buy many more nodes now. I'm pretty much like fully upgraded. 
Oh, hello. Only avoid disturbing my other patients. What is this? Research, of course. Oh, I'm Jesus. So close to finding that missing factor. A unitop just would understand. I'll put him out of the misery. There you go. Oh my god. They went bloody flying. Okay, I can't kill that one. That one I can. Cheese and crepes. This is not a nice place. Hello? Hello? Demons? Oh, oh no, it's alright. Oh, I feel really claustrophobic in this bit for some reason. Feels like there's a really kind of like tight field of view. Oh, these things. Ah, you bastard. Oh, I hate these. No, I hate them. I hate them. I hate them. Right, freeze him. Oh, done it at the wrong time. Done. Done. No, he's not done. Mate, stop. Stop. Jesus. Really? Overkill. I feel like I, I think I feel like these are places I've actually been. I have been here, yeah. Earlier. Oh, hello, Miles. Hope you're well. Having a very good time with this. It's very good. There must be like one. There must be one or two more upgrades for the plasma car because yeah, look, look at all that up there, and it seems to be that they're filling in. Because I do think the suit goes to six, um, five on your first playthrough, and then there's a sixth upgrade if you do New Game Plus. What does that say there? It's okay to be fucked up. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Good sentiment. I'm a bit fucked up. We're all a bit fucked up. Clearance confirmed. Is that fused to the ship or just in a hole? What, this thing? Oh, honestly, they're kind of fused to, a sh to the ship. They're, they're disgusting. Properly, properly disgusting. I hate them. Uh, I'm going up. Did I go in there? Did I go in there earlier? Doesn't matter. Can't go in there now. Does not matter. Okay, up we go. Missed it. I'm on level 666 now. I am. I'm on. <laughs> I'm basically completing the game. Ah, there it is. There. Oh, flip off. Where have you gone? Oh, oh, oh. Oh my god. Stupid thing. Yeah, I'm properly backtracking now. This is all... We've been here earlier. We've been all the, in all these places. It's so dark. Cheers, Benjo. It's coming tomorrow. What? What's coming tomorrow? Sorry. I'm losing track of what I'm saying. What's coming tomorrow? I've got something coming tomorrow. Command strips. Very exciting. Very exciting Amazon delivery. It means I'm going to be able to put up some, like, prints and frame pictures and things. Which is always, you know, it's always a, it makes the house feel more homely, I think. Patient log retrieved. Get some pictures on the walls. There. I have to record the uh, The old memory, you know. Clearance As I was saying. The new yep. treatment I'm developing should be just the ticket. Interesting. I was in here earlier, but now there's an audio log. Promising. Trial. Uh, you'll be back at your hmm. post in a jiffy with CEC none the wiser. You know Unless what else is gooey right now? Oh, I don't like that. No. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Oh. 
get in there. Right, I want to I see. I want to see the creature, the big, horrible, unkillable creature. I keep setting myself new points to stop, but that will be where I'll stop. I'll go and do the bit with the creature. Ah! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Jesus Christ! For the last time, get a trauma my word. Okay, I'm gonna go that way. This way looks like it, there's probably got some good stuff down it because there were just some creatures pouring out of there. So like, I couldn't go this way earlier apparently. Level two. Ah, there you go. New room. New room. Sell it, sell it. All this good stuff can be sold. All this good stuff can be sold. And a node. I mean that as well. Lovely, lovely, lovely. This game is getting messy now. Blood and slime everywhere. It gets messier as it goes on. It starts throwing in all kinds of weird creatures. And they just get slimier and slimier. Um, and then by the end, you, you barely tell what's going on. It all just looks like viscera and blood and pus. It's great. This really is a better version of Dead Effect 2. Dead Effect is fun. Um, I like that game, but yeah. Um, I think Dead Effect... I'd have to look at the release dates for these things, but I think Dead Effect was probably very heavily inspired by Dead Space. It always felt very Dead Spacey to me. Um, going that way, so let's go this way. I played Dead Effect 2 in VR. I, I, I did like it. It's, it's quite simplistic. Um, what is that? Oh, it's just where I came from. It's the door I couldn't get through earlier. Um, yeah, quite simplistic, but it felt a bit doomy in its approach. Um, oh, Nicole again. There it is. There it is, the creature. Twitter folly. <laughs> I'll check it out when I'm done in a bit. If 80s cartoons were Scottish. I think I've seen a Postman Pat where it's like northern. I'm so glad this turned out good as well, man. After Callisto Protocol, which wasn't terrible, but wasn't what I wanted it to be. You know, it was a little bit underbaked. It's so good that this is really well put together remake. Just a trick. Whoa, whoa, he stasis me. Isaac Clark. All right. Dr. Brennan's nearest and dearest. Oh, this is cool. We were colleagues, you know. Dr. Chalice. Uh -huh. Of course. the reason the marker won't begin? That's it. Take care, Peanut. Have a great week, Emma. Convergence is installed. <laughs> She's meddling. How is the question? But even if I was to ask, I suspect you're not the talkative type. And I haven't fully explored the cause of death as that missing factor. Oh my god. Dismemberment. Now I think we're on the right track there. <laughs> they remade Dead Space. Back, they bloody did it. Convergence is so close. Maybe your death will tip the balance. Oh shit. Here it comes. <laughs> right, 
just slow him down. There's nothing else that can be done. You can't kill the thing. It just grows its limbs back. Oh, I hate them. I hate them. Give me that, give me that, give me that. Doke. I hit the cold broadcast. It was a trick by a fucking unitologist. Dr. Mercer. He's locked down medical to experiment on the crew. Oh, How do I get out? Every way out is locked down to one of the offices. It must be Mercer's. I can brute force the internal doors, but you will have to reach his office and lift the lockdown manually. Who put this here? I think the map was already already been there. This way, okay. Good morning, ja good morning, Jamie. It's like night time here, but good morning. Finish compound on hard. Good job, man. Our compound's flipping tough. The game doesn't pull any punches. My hunter may regenerate, but he takes an attack like that personally. Nice. Send him after me again then. Ah, shit. Oh. Whoa. Shit, okay. Bit of a problem now. Get past, get past, get past, that's it. Peace, 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 peace. Peace, 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 peace. Ah, I've been in there. Thank you. Whoa. Another gun that I won't use. Whew. Hello, Mr. Survivor. How are we doing? Is that noise? Oh, not you again. Oh my god, that's not doing it. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. My whole head went off. My whole head went off. It went boom, it was gone. Shit, okay. The fuck? Hold on, hold on. Can I use this machine? I'm like literally out of ammo. And I need I need ammo before I go through this bit. So Oh god, okay. This feels harder to do the plasma cutter only run. Um Yep. Yep. Shot. Plasma bullets. Can I get 72? Yeah, I'll do. Cool, that's better. I should be more equipped now. There we go. <sighs> you died. Oops, I did die. I died a disgusting death. My head just went popping off. Okay. So helmets don't save lives, no. Oh, that's this room again. Go, 
go, go, go, go. I got it, I got it, I got it. Surgical lock. Dr. Charles Moses. When I began my research, Kevin's kind insights into the marker were invaluable. Now is the Lucius is sending little missives like this one. You butcher. I saw it's gonna feel so good to kill that stupid creature. It used to be. It used to feel great. Okay, so these things are so much harder to kill now. Spit out, little baby. Kill that, and then. Done. We're done. Oh, there's another one in there. Oh. Jesus. Uh, in there, but if I go down, what am I going to get if I go down there? What is that? Is it worth it? Oh, God. Is it worth it? Let me work it. Put your thing down, flip it, and reverse it. Uh, not really worth it. The children of the marker, kind necromorphs, have provided all the material I could ask for. And these music is so good. Provided a key insight. Implanting the material directly into the frame render is optimal results. <gasps> of course, that requires puncturing the frontal bone just above the glabella. Please, please, no. Don't worry. Okay, through that. It's been sterilized. <gasps> oh, man. We've been dragged on the floor yet with the tentacles out of the wall. I did. I did. I haven't killed that creature, but it did do the thing where it grabs you and pulls you along the floor. Ruby Semiconductor. Hell yeah. Sell that for big money. Look at that. Look at that. Filth. Okay, where are we going now? Hello. I don't think we can. Not me. Save hydroponics. We're all dying. There's poison. But there's still time. Her end time will work if... Torch is freaking out. She just needs liquid nitrogen. Save us! Alright. We'll do. See you later, mate. Okay. Well, he's dead now. He was right. Air quality is dropping ship wide. Oh, the eye laser scenes in the second game. It's one of the best supply. bits, but it's in the second game. He came looking for liquid nitrogen, and there has to be some in the There's a head in the jar there. Okay. Not like we have a better oh. option. I'll clear you a path to cryo. I smashed something. Door protocols rebooted. Thank you for your patience. That's all right. I'm nothing if not patient. Okay. Oh god, yeah. That is a toxic hat. What's happening here? Oh god, no. Oh, so behind me. Is it him? Yeah. Oh no, it's something else. Okay, yeah, it's fine. Oh shit, 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 shit. Stop the poison gas. Yeah, I'm trying, mate. I'm up. I'm also dying. Oh my god. Oh no, he's here. Oh my lord, oh my lord, oh my lord. I'm panicking a bit now. Go! Oh shit! Oh 
Oh no. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. There's nothing I can do. What do I do now? That was so close. That was probably that last second or something. Oh god. I didn't realize I had that. Okay, it's clearing. Oxygen Let's pump that gas in from hydroponics. The air's already that bad. I'm gonna need a faster way to cryogenics. That was probably on, on like literally a second lab. or something. It'll take you straight there. Holy hell. That was nuts. Swinging around his dead space dick. Who's doing that? Who's doing that? Who's got a dead space dick? What the f What's happening? What does that mean? Alright, we're gonna get a node. Treat myself. Good to have. And um, we're gonna get some more of this. Because it's the only thing that matters. <sighs> you mess with the ball, you get the wang. What is happening? What is happening? What are you saying now? You're just saying words, and then none of them really make sense anymore. None of them really make sense anymore. Four hours and 17 minutes. I'm smashing this out. This, this game doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Willies. Willies are funny, to be honest. They are pretty funny. They do look pretty funny. Oh, wait. Purple-headed yogurt launcher. Don't like that. That makes me feel a bit sick. Just a feel a bit a little bit sick. Hello. Oh, for God's sake. No. Don't want to get that one's sack. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, it's, it's ramping up now, um, difficulty-wise. It no longer feels like a walk in the park. I am being tested, and I am using uh, resources now. So, yeah, things are things are happening. What do you call them over there? Weenies. Well, I don't call them purple-headed yogurt launchers. We uh, it's, in the UK, it's most most commonly probably just called a dick, like. It's a dick. Like, oh, there's a dick. Like, that's just, that's probably the, the, or cock. But cock is a bit more like, sounds a bit harsher. Cock. Dick is kind of like, eh, dick. Silly dick over there. Look at that dick, you know. It's fine. Right, I'm going to get this chapter done. And then, then I'll stop. For real. I'm not lying anymore. Telling Level you the truth. Because I don't think I'm that far off. No. There we go. This cannot be undone. I don't want to undo it. I want to continue to push forward. Why would I undo my save? That's insane. Um, okay. Come on then. Clink, clonk, clink. That's fine. I don't need that security clearance yet. Uh, it rhymes with pee pee. Wee wee pee pee. Uh, what else rhymes with pee pee? D D. Hee hee. Pee pee. C C. Uh, liquid nitrogen. Done. Easy. You son of a bitch. But you. Shut up, mate. You're a psychopath. Can you say the same thing? I can say I'm not a psychopath, mate. Speaking of courtesy. Uh, oh, I can't move the chair. Uh. You are bold, bro. I am bold. I'm the boldest of bold people. Wait, do you mean bold as in like brave or bold as in bold? Because I am bold. What's that? It's like a tyrant. Like a flipping Resident Evil monster. And I doubt even you can stop a convergence event fueled by the entire population of Earth. You 
take these things to Earth. It's all over. Only for the faithless. Oh Jesus. Humanity. That looks like a forty nine. We made her all, Mr. Clark. With or without you. See you later, mate. I'd say My butt is so numb. My butt is the numbest it's ever been. I'm like I'm trying to like get a bit of blood into it, but I need to just like walk around, do some squats. Oh Jesus Christ. Come here, you silly sausage. Run, 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 run. Go, 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 go. Initiating cryogenic freeze. Easy. Transferring specimen to storage. How easy was that? Did it immediately. Froze the bastard. Done. Bastard locked me out again. He's not dead yet, though. Isaac, you okay? I stopped that hunter in. The Mercer's gone. He wants to take these things to Earth, Kendra. You have to seal the captain's nest and warn Hammond. Okay, I can seal the nest, but I haven't been able to reach Hammond since he went to the crew deck. Hammond's a baddie. Air quality is a bad fast. man. If you've got liquid nitrogen, we gotta fix hydroponics. On it. Keep trying to reach Hammond. Mercer, I don't think he's done yet. Is that the way I came in? Yes. That is the way I came in. There we go. Chapter 5 is done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, he's find a safe one. Oh, my back hurts. There, there isn't a VR mod for, um, for Dead Space. Um, if you've seen any... There's an access door in there that'll take you to hydroponics. Okay. If you've seen any like Dead Space in VR gameplay, like me or, or anyone else's channels, um, it's typically using Vorpex. Um, to kind of push it into a 3D space inside the headset. But there's no official VR mod for Dead Space. Um, hopefully at some point there will be one. I would absolutely love that. But I, 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 I'm looking for something of the same quality of the Prey Dog Resident Evil mods, if I'm honest. Full motion controls, I want it all. I want it all, because it would just be phenomenal. Make me a very, very happy boy. So if someone wants to make that, that'd be cool. I'll pay you. I'll pay you to make a full-blown mod for this. Ah, oh, look at that. Oh, scary. What was that? Lockdown override. Okay. Uh, what's that way, then? What's in that door? Hold on. I can't even see. What's in here? Save station. That'll do. Oh, bloody do! Oh. Hey, you know what? Five chapters in one evening. Four hours and 24 minutes. That ain't bloody bad. You know, I'm pretty happy with that. The internet has managed to hold itself together. I haven't had any issues. It seemed pretty good. Modders are getting too good. Seems like every game I see someone play now first few minutes of watching and deciding if it'd be worth modding to VR. Honestly, the modders are getting uh, insanely good, terrifyingly good, and they're, they're getting quicker at producing these mods as well. Like, they're just like... I, I blink and there's a mod for it. I mean, the, the Metal Hellsinger one, I, I put a comment in the Discord when that game came out. I was like, oh, it'd be good if someone modded this. And now we have, like, full motion control mod for it. It's, um... Yeah, it's, it's getting... It's getting pretty crazy. It's getting pretty wacky out there, people. It's getting pretty goofy. Uh, right, I am going to stop because one, I need a wee. Two, I have my uh, my back hurts. Three, my bum's you know bloody numb as shit. Um, and four, I need to eat something. So yeah, butt hurts, back hurts, everything. It's all wrong. Uh, when's the Bendy Doctor Beef mod coming out? It's actually out, but I, don't, I think it's still only available through Patreon. I don't think it's gone into public release yet. It will go public release. It will be a free um, download, but I don't think it's there yet. I think it's still in in um. Patreon, so I think you still need to pay for it. So, unless it, unless it is out publicly and I've just missed it, but I know it's done. 
I know it's finished. They've made it. Uh, I'm planning to play this on Sunday night as well, I think. Um, as, if, if everything goes right, I'll be back on Sunday night. I want to blast through it as quickly as possible because I, I love this game. And I just want to play more of it. Um, so, yeah, like, chances are I'll be, I'll be back on Sunday night to blast through some more. I won't be here tomorrow. Tomorrow night I've got my giant Chinese feast to eat. And we're going to do escape room. And then Monday is Molly's birthday. So, on Monday, we'll just be chilling. No online presence. Uh, and then Tuesday, it will be like video upload day. So yeah, probably, probably Sunday. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for congratulating me on 100k. 100k is absolutely insane. Um, and I will do a proper, like, silly stream where I play some VR games and I get a bit drunk and we just party and we just celebrate hitting that milestone once I'm a little bit more settled in the house and you know this room is a lot more usable i haven't even set up really my standing space yet so i want to have that set up but I'd, I'd love to do like just a silly stream where we just we just play like phasmophobia and vr games and maybe get some people to come in and play together and stuff um yeah it'd be nice to just properly properly kick back play some silly games have a drink and yeah we'll, we'll have some fun right <laughs> Thank you for surviving so long on this godforsaken planet. I know, right? We want to see you, you unbox the YouTube trophy thing. I will record that when I get it. I don't know when it happens. I think you have to wait a few weeks and then you get a button on your channel and then you click it and you can order the, the plaque. Um, but I haven't had that button yet, so it might take a little while. Right. Much love to you all. Thank you for hanging out with me tonight. I know it's been a longer stream than normal. I've gone all the way to 11 o'clock. Mental. He's, he's insane. Um... But yeah, I've really enjoyed myself, and in this new space, I should be able to do longer, more enjoyable, engaging streams. Thank you for joining me. Have a great day tomorrow. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and I'll see you soon for another one. Love you all very much. Peace out. Enjoy the rest of your night. Take care. How do I stop streaming? I never know how. I'll click this